Good evening, Kaizo Ironmon VOD viewers and friends of the stream. I hope you're all doing well this fine Thursday into Friday. Welcome, Green welcome, y'all. Wow, congrats on the first. Hello, hello. Whenever you're watching this back, make sure you have a drink and a snack. Enjoy the stream, enjoy the VOD, etc. We're closing in on 200 attempts of Black 2 Kaiser of Iron Mon today. Unless I just win on the next one. Or the one after that. Thank you again, everybody. Yesterday, not yesterday, Tuesday, during Halloween, who came around and supported the charity stream. Here's some ads. It was a success. Uh, we hit $2,002.69. Nice for gamers outreach and it was epic i think everything should be changed back except you know what i forgot to change the panels on my channel that was what i forgot everything else should be changed back uh except maybe exclamation point donate that might have been fucked as well but that was a successful blues day i had a lot of fun yes i forgot to change that successful blues day It was great. Thank you so much for being a part of it. If you did, if you were there yesterday to witness it, it was good fun. I had a lot of fun. Hopefully everybody had a good time with Halloween as well. Let me get this. I have to put my, my links back in here. Another exciting piece of news information for those right here at the start is that I am confirmed to be running at uh, GDQ Hotfix, which is just all of the shows that they do in between all of their events. So they're usually live. They're live right now with a Pokemon Crystal uh, full item randomizer, which is probably shenanigans or Chrism doing that. I uh, would be surprised. But there's other people who play those as well. Uh, so I'll be doing that on the 29th this month. And leading up to that, that means Animal Crossing City Folk runs on the alt channel. So that's what I'll be doing on the alt, exclamation point alt, awu, twitch.tv slash awu. We'll be, we'll be starring Animal Crossing. I thought I was going to do golf or Kirby Air right next over there, but that, that came out of nowhere uh, on Halloween. I was like, oh, yeah, okay, let's do that. So we have uh, pivoted to Animal Crossing content on the alt. I will probably start that tomorrow. If I can get a run going tomorrow, or feel like doing so tomorrow afternoon to evening, expect Animal Crossing uh, then. Okay, I didn't do exclamation point donate yet. Just gotta fix this. I did disable the timer, so that's not going. Donate to my big butt... My big butt... Uh, fund here there we go new <laughs> new exclamation point donate command check this out that will be for me getting a large butt that's my new fund thank you for all contributions cool how's the how's november been for y'all cold cold and then 1K, I, I, my haircut is like perfect length, I think, to start looking into dyeing it. So I might, that might be the next thing I do because I've kind of been building up to a lot of stuff happening. And then TwitchCon's done, Halloween and Blues Day is done. I don't really have anything big planned now. Uh, I don't really have any big plans at all for a while. So maybe I can uh, get some time to work up the confidence to dye my hair. Dumpy Thank you, Yas, for the $5. Dumpy Inbound. Wowie Dumper, dude. Let's go. <laughs> Wowie Dumper. Thank you, Yas. You don't have to do that, but I appreciate it. Heck yeah. Good to see you all again. Hopefully you got to enjoy Blues Day. If not, the VOD for Blues Day is now live on the VOD channel. It took me another day. It took 22 hours to process that MF. -er. Thing was thick. Thick file. <laughs> All right, yeah, and I think besides that, I think everything is good to go. We have a lot to work to do to get the um, layout correct for GDQ. Two people running Golden Net and Animal Crossing City Folk with the trackers, with the maps, 
with our webcams. It's going to be a very crowded layout, but we've already started work on it today, and it's uh, really exciting. I think it's going to look uh, fantastic. It's going to be like webcam and town map right next to each other. <laughs> I think it'll be really cool. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. I'm kind of... And then, you know what they said? You know what they said? They said, when we do that hotfix run, it's going to make for a really banger submission to the main GDQ events. Because it's going to have the right layout to show the casual viewers what to focus on, right? They're going to be like, oh, well, we need to perfect this element to it. Which means when we use that as a submission video, ooh, that's a spicy meatball. You know what I mean? So maybe, maybe City Folk will get into a main GDQ soon. Maybe SGDQ 2024? Pause champ? Because we'll have one heck of a submission video for it. So that would be pretty dope. I would love to see that pipeline happen, because I definitely think it's worth it. It was my favorite submission for this GDQ, which none of them got in. Uh, but then it was picked out by the GDQ hosts from all of the all of the runs. They're like, ooh, can we find some good ones that aren't going to be shown at AGDQ? And highlight them on the Hotfix Marathon, which is a really cool way of uh, propping that up, so... Very happy with that. Alright. Let me say hello to everybody. Let's get to some better music, although I have to go to the next seed before I start. Let me say hello to everybody. What's up, Green? Congrats on the first today. Hello, Sam Pack, Jane, MSBMK, Zeller, Water Dragons, M, Tyler, Michael, Notif Gang. Let's go. Xerion, enjoy the skill, Ironmon. Love to hear more about that from you. I know you're all up in this Discord, but I haven't had the time to read all of that. Um, but um, I, I do think it's interesting. Phil brought it up. You know, we've kind of been talking about it, so I'm, I, I think it's dope. Oh, by the way, I'll also be doing a Pokemon Cry for Phil's uh, custom ROM thing that he's doing. I'm going to do Arcanine, actually. He's right there. <laughs> I'm gonna do I'm gonna do an Arcanine cry for that ROM. It's gonna be super embarrassing and cringe and awesome. So expect that. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Hello Leechy, Moonvise, Lemon Lake, Ivan, NZ, Yes, Milksy, David Byrne, I Nerd, NZ. I already said that. NZ gets two today. Tony, thank you for the bit. QB gay. Tangelo, hello. Congrats on the world record. Um, you said that Wild Weather Woods and Balmy are the most accessible. Blustery. Just saying. Blustery. That one's the easiest by far. Balmy is the second, though. I agree with you there. Blustery, though, needs to be improved. <laughs> like, please. I've been- I literally have 28 under and I missed a- I circled or- I- I- I rimmed another eagle. And that was just a random online match with unpredictable wins, and also we didn't have, uh, we didn't have the iterations for RNG back then, so I had no idea what things I was getting. Beat that shit. <laughs> Come on. It was back to you. <laughs> Thank you, Jane, I appreciate it. What's up, Lost Hell, Ariel, Nonstop, Nut, November? Hello, Skew T, I'll get to that submission in just a bit. Thank you again, Yas, for five dollars. Temperature, thank you for the four months on the Prime. Good to see you again, friend. Enjoy the emotes, ad-free viewing today. I got I got hit with a lot of ads because Sand and I were watching uh, Tears of the Kingdom run, just per chance. And I got hit with all those ads, and I was like, how do you guys watch this? <laughs> like, I could not. I can't do Twitch with ads. I'm sorry. Hello, Adam. Hope you're doing well. Hello, hello. Yoon. Uh, text. Hogline. Gregory. Slug. Cats. Phobos. Faint Smile, Vicool, Squashy, Myrari, Luna, Seelin, Vito Man. Yeah, I rimmed. Yeah, I was rimming. Imagine imagine a gay guy rimming. Wow, who would have thought? Anyways, now that you've now that you're thinking about that. Let's do a weather redemption for Torun Poland. Is this one of those ones where I'm gonna have to know the local geography first? I'll look at it, but I'm probably not gonna, I'm probably not gonna get my wherewithal just from what I usually look at, which is just weather underground. Uh, there's two of them. There's four of them. There's five of them. I don't know which one it is. 
There, there's a lot of them. Which one is it? <laughs> I'm just gonna go with the first one. Kuyavayan Pomeranian Vovodiship Voivodiship. This looks like the biggest one. Okay, it doesn't look that exceptional. Just looking at it. Doesn't look that exceptional. That one? Okay. You need to know what to send your dude. Oh, very good. I thought you were trying to throw some local topography at me. I mean, it is in a river valley, I assume. It's right along a river, so... Perhaps a little bit chillier at nighttime than what some forecasts suggest. Could be possible with radiational cooling. But, for the most part, uh, I see a Pacific Northwest pattern for this place. It is basically the same temperature every day for the next 10 days. Stagnant pattern with a lot of rain here and there. So, a lot of rain today. Now, until, like, the end of the entire day. 24 hours of rain. And then, chances for rain every... Like, it looks pretty consistent. I think you could definitely pick out the same forecast as I could. But right about 10 Celsius every day for the high. And a small diurnal uh, range here. It only cools off like 5 or 6 Celsius maximum each day. So wintertime close for sure. Uh, simply because it's not going to get warm, but it's not going to get super cold. Yeah, it's cold and it rains a lot. I see it. Alright, who else said this? Zelacore, Shasta, Nitro... Yeah, go ahead and open the queue ceiling if you'd like to. 11 minutes in, we are good to go. Yeah, definitely take a break from that. I mean, if you don't do it, maybe I will. Because that one's always been the one that's pissed me off. Blustery, just existing. It definitely deserves a new record. Maybe I'll just do it. But I'm gonna be busy with Animal Crossing City Folk, so... Let's get started. Today with Kaizu Ironmon in Black 2, attempt number 198. Here we go. We're gonna start with right. Seelan always gets that preferential bias, man. He's like, yeah, I get to open the queue and choose right every time. Fuck all of you guys. <laughs> it's like, I know when the queue's open. I just, every time that happens, I, I laugh when I remember he had, he was like frantically typing right to get it in before everybody else did. Because <laughs> he opened it, he couldn't even be fast enough himself. <laughs> yeah, I'd love to get it. It's kind of my course, isn't it? 28 under, and it's the online record. And tied world record overall. Like, it's just funny. Maybe I should do it. But it pisses me off. I hate that game. <laughs> that game should have been eight times more what it is. So it pisses me off every time I think about it. What's up, Aminus? Juniper. Altius, hope you're doing well. Well, hope that helps, QT. That's cool you know someone there in Poland. Hello, Bed Goblin. Hope you're doing well. Right. Okay. Hiplup. Hiplup. I don't mean to put it down, though, because there's still so many people who enjoy it. Honestly, pretty impressive to me. I respect the hell out of them. Happy to host the community that they thrive in as well. I wanted to get into GDQ, so maybe, maybe, just maybe, there's some niche community out there that is just looking for a game that is fully predictable. To a, to a certain extent. Just like that one. And the moment that Didi does get the... Does take the record back in no DLC, we can go for a perfect run. And that would be pretty cool. So there's still things to do. I'm dead. Good start. Critical, super effective frenzy plant. That's gonna set the... Tone for today, it appears. Be back in April. Oh, gosh. Yeah. Man, going to Poland all the way till April. That is a lot. You're doing hella good. I think he's been there for at least a while now already. 
You are staying strong. What's up, Santis? Antoine, good to see you. Hope you have a good night, though, Altus. Altius, what the heck? Hello, Seashell. Good to see you around. So, I read the uh, Twitch stuff today. Like, I knew about the... We were talking about the new animated emote slots and so forth. What I didn't really get clearly the first time, though, is that I think there's more than five more coming. As far as I could tell, the wording implied that we're getting five more regardless, but you get even more if you use Twitch's first-party alerts, so they're trying to incentivize it heavily. I already use it without that incentive, because I do think it's good for certain elements, like hype trains and, you know, so forth, and the celebrations with all the blue dog emotes going everywhere. I like that. Some people don't. <laughs> I've heard their complaints. But, uh, I don't give a shit. But it seems like I think you're gonna get actually even more than five more animated emotes, so there is an ass load of animated emotes coming. I wish we had more static slots, it almost seems overwhelming. It might be like 13, 14, 15 animated emotes, like, holy crap. It's like, what do you do? <laughs> the Pokemon with the highest spice tolerance. Thanks, Dylan. Hello, Dusk. Fisting. Holy shit. Look at this fucking lab. Well, I, I think we'll do- th this is like- this would have been a really interesting, um, redemption if I- if Chandelure wasn't on my favorites. But, favorites. So we'll do it again. That lab is fucked. Honestly, Chandelure's kind of the worst one of the three. Ah, oh. So close to being good. Breeze! I think it would be Typhlosion too, but Chandelure is convincing, because it literally has fire inside of it. <laughs> Dang. I mean, he kind of has the spread. All he needs is Sword Stance, actually. Or Bulk Up. Or Coil. He just got it. Like, if he gets those, it actually works. <laughs> so it is unfortunate. The moves are garbage, though. I wish, I wish he had the moves for it. Wow, Typhlosion was slower than dirt. Yeah, Typhlosion sucks, it's just slow. <laughs> yeah, D-Dance would be bad, but we have enough speed, I'd say. Dude, can this- can he not hit me? Moment. Chandelier moment. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was another crit! <laughs> he can't hit me! Bro sucks. He's slower than dirt, and he can't hit me. Wow, imagine being this trash. Thankfully, we didn't pick Typhlosion. Yeah, the spice tolerant ones are um, the plus attack natures. They're the ones that like spicy food, so we picked correctly. This is a naughty chandelier that likes spicy food. What's up, Kato? It's good to see you back around. What's been going on? You been keeping busy? Yeah, that's fair. I know a lot of people who are the same, essentially. I can't hit this thing. Oh, I'll work, yeah. That's your favorite tornado? Cool, cow doggy. Yeah, that one's a monster for sure. It's good that you're watching those videos. They'll take some time to grasp, but. I mean, I can, I can try to interpret it as well, because I do know everything he's talking about in there. 600 series at Bowling League? 600? Two games to 300? You only did two games, right? Ooh, grinder chat, just in time. Hope you're doing well, cow doggy. Sheiker. Welcome, welcome. Can we check the others afterwards? Well, we know Typhlo's and just trash, so yeah, well, we should see what Zoroark is. Furries! Yep, it's a stoner. Learns no moves. That's why we're sad. 
perfect speed. Like, it, it has a spread if it has um, sword. If it has any physical setup. Even D dance, even though I don't really want that. Even shift gear can work. Three games? Oh, over 200 average. I mean, shit, it's good. Oh, you didn't even- you didn't just throw 600, you threw 627. You gotta give yourself full credit there. Go to the max number. Yeah, that's good bowling. I watch people bowl and at the Twitch partner party at TwitchCon. Oh wait, this is the other thing. <laughs> so I- I- yeah, I know the- I know what a 200 looks like and I know what a 7 looks like. Hmm. <laughs> Did they fix reply threads? I thought it was still kind of... I thought it was still kind of fucky. I, well, I guess it was still kind of fucky because it looks like you're adding yourself. Does it not do that anymore? I thought it still looked like you're adding yourself, which is funny. My favorite tornado is Fairdale. That one's easy. I mean, I, I just listened to the audio again yesterday. From Klim Schultz's video. Ne that is the only thing on this planet that never fails to make me shiver. That shit is fucking wicked. I wish there was... Well, I don't wish, but I... If there, if there is anything else that's like that, even close to, it would be astonishing to listen to. Nothing else makes me... sends a shiver down my spine like that does. Unbelievable piece of media that exists. I wish I saw more of Kyoto, yeah. That's been the case for two months? I swear I just... I swear I still see it the other way. I don't know why. We're doing well, bootless Josie, if I didn't say that. <laughs> Mr. Raven, 35. Yeah, I'd probably be 5. I love Chandler. What's up, basement? Licking! Bruh. True, Scooty. I missed everything. <laughs> My chase cation started the day after Spalding. Which is hilarious. At least I saw a damn tornado, goddammit. <laughs> Honestly, I'm pretty happy with that day because we saw a tornado that seemingly no one else did. Or very few other people did on that same storm in Grady. In New Mexico. Not many people saw that. Because we saw, like, no pictures of it besides ours and Jordan's and, or, like, a couple of other chase teams. Everyone else just got on the main road and was going away from it, didn't see it. Kind of weird. Although, <laughs> we basically stayed till the second the frickin' outflow got to us. So it was pretty risky. For newbies, at least. Which I was one. But to see the first tornado and it being, like, on a very slim, uh, very slim escapability, <laughs> so to speak. That was pretty cool. It added to the action. It added to the recount, the tale. Get out of bed for it. What's up, Cosmo? They do plain spotting. No, I had no idea something was happening. Yesterday, I sat in my own filth. <laughs> I was dead after uh, Blues Day. I kind of just sat there and was like, yeah. I played Suica game for an hour, and then I just did nothing.
Okay. Kind of want to know what its fourth move is if I'm going to get it. I'm still out speeding it after one speed down. Do I speed it? Do I outspeed it now? Oh, fuck. That's horrid. Okay. And Weather Ball! God damn it! It had a decent moveset, too. Shoot. Shoot. Dang it. Ah. That's actually kind of sad. No, dude. That Raichu could have been okay. I, I lowered its speed. Oh, wait. I wasn't lowering its speed. What the fuck am I talking about? I didn't lower its speed at all. What am I doing? I lowered its accuracy. Oh no, it icy winded me twice. Sorry, that was what I was thinking about. My speed was 14 and it I was still out speeding it. God damn it. These stupid stat changes are getting to me. <laughs> Which one am I trying to think about? Also, tonight's beverage is once again the prickly pear Dr. Pepper, mixed by yours pure. Cheers to chat. Hope you're all doing well. It was pretty interesting. I went through the Suica game directory earlier today, just seeing what everyone's high scores were, and there was not a single person who's gotten the double. Not a single one. There were people with 3,600, which is almost as close as getting the double. You usually get it at like 37 or 38. So, they must have gotten awfully close, but nobody had it who was streaming on Twitch. I feel like that's a super niche thing to have, and it makes me like the damn game even more. Such a weird challenge. Such a weird challenge. Everybody just wants to stop at 3k, and I think that's boring as fuck. Don't stop at 3k, go for the actual challenge of the game that only 100 people have managed to do. Out of, like, the impressions on the game from, like, 70 billion people. It's so boring. Go for the actual challenge. Oh, this thing is... That mud slap... Mud slap... Mud slap not lower its accuracy? Oh, shit! This has shield dust or something. How much special type? Ooh. Is this worth getting? Charge Beam, Shield Dust, or Clear Body, whichever one. Good defenses. I mean, as long as he doesn't have zero speed, bro's kind of got something going here. When's it learn to move? Nine? Hmm. LB, they are the raid! I'm looking at this Wayless right now in Black 2 Kaizo. I'm trying to figure out if I like him, because he is good defensively with shield dust or clear body and charge beam and adequate special attack. What an interesting time to raid. How was the stream? Uh, you were doing Heart Gold Survival today, right? That's always a nutcracker. For lack of a better descriptor. <laughs> Hope that was fun. Sword Stance Electivire? Oh, come on. You can't just... You can't just win! You're supposed to make it a challenge! Good luck. <laughs> What's up, Four Stray? We are just starting today. I got a favorite chandelier out of the lab. It doesn't quite have the juice that it takes to win, but if it got Swords Dance, like freaking LB has, then we'd be fine. Now I'm trying to decide if I want this Swayless or not. Because he basically has a 100% chance to be a good Pokemon but has to get to level 64. It's a far cry in hell, and we've only seen four things here. 
One of which is a Raichu that's too slow, otherwise it's good. It has good moves for a Raichu. So I think I'm probably going to go Zueless. It's going to take a while to get this at level 9 again, or 11. It learns a move at 9 though, so if I get it at 8, I get to see another move, which might make it more worthwhile. There is no real need to catch this at 11, besides being at a better level. Oh, you're doing the survival stuff. EV training with power bracers, ridiculous. Nice work. Hope you're all doing well, though, coming from LB's raid. We're just getting started. I evo to fracture, LB. Exclamation point last. It's still the last command. Turned into a shit flag on, unfortunately. But I evo it. Fracture out of burr command. <laughs> it was fucking awesome. It's the first evo run I've ever done. Mid evo, uh, dragon evo. I've never done a dragon evo in heart gold. 3,800 tries, and it happened in this game. It was ridiculous. And I mean, I've already had the pure powers wayless, and that didn't do it. I should probably get this at level 8. I do like it, though. I do like it. Song, they were the 21! They were the 21. My beautiful wowie boys. Not only that, but we're getting so many more animated emote slots, too, which is wicked. Wicked cool. It wouldn't need to PB to evolve, Cosmo. Is that such a problem? Is that such a problem? Welcome, B2 Guns, Ninja Friend. I'm doing alright. I'm doing alright. I want the Chandelure to be runnable, but I'm doing okay be besides that. Thank you, Forestray. Level 8 nature, yeah, I'm not sure if that was a good nature or not, I kinda just left it. I think it's worth getting a, another move check when it really doesn't matter if I get it at 8 or 11 at this point. Yeah, I was really hoping for that 40%, 39% to be a pseudo-legend, man. And we checked Hydreigon in that seed, it was a perfect physical attacker spread. Hurts my soul, man. The rest of them were kinda garbo, but if I got that 9% Hydreigon, that was the one! Thank you, Duckburg, for the two-month resub. Welcome back. Bezos bucks taken. Filed. It will go into the big ass fund. Thank you, Miles, for the raid. Hello, Blurge. Oh my god, Blur made me think of Pokemon Sleep. <laughs> I got the most ridiculous. Miles, I hope your stream went well. Sorry, I have everything in my brain now. I got the most ridiculous pull. I don't think I've ever seen anyone pull a better Pokemon just out of the gate on Pokemon Sleep. Shiny Banette. Shiny Banette. Level 8. 6. Shiny Banette. With berry finding. And helping speed. And ingredient down nature. It was literally perfect. I, I still can't believe it. So now I have a perfect Shiny Banette in the game. I don't know what's happening, man. My brain is blasted. Ingredient down nature. Like, you don't, you can't, you just don't, you don't see it. It doesn't happen. That, that's the first it doesn't happen in Pokemon Sleep that I've had. It doesn't happen. Alright, Piplup. Piplupping. Thank you, Phobos, for the five months, once again, enacting the pipe train. That seems to be your, your gym. You always do the hype train. I'm so happy for you. Yeah, Madge. Yeah, so that's my that's my shining star now. Shiny Banette. What the fuck? Drain- Oh, shit. Drano's Heart Gold Soul Silver ROM hack? Yo, what is this? Um... Really good defense. Judgment? Furries. I don't know what that is actually, but since 2008 is pretty cool. 
I want it to hit, but I don't even know if it has a move, so whatever, I'll just lower its act. Oh, now it does. Fucking hell. This might be the 4%, so I do not want it to go away. It's not gonna hit me with pluck, though. I wish I had a freaking status heal at the start so I could just spam it. Oh, I do! What the pog champ, dude? Oh! I threw a little bit, but let's see if I can get it to use pluck on me and hit. That's so clutch, what the hell? <laughs> I love scouting in this game, dude. Matt, you just get to do this for free. Like, God, it's so good. Alright, use pluck on me, dingbat. Thank you again for the five months, Phobos! So what is, uh... What is Drano's a a heart gold hack? What is, what is the... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. This guy might be fucking amazing. Now I have a fucking decision to make between Zuelus and this. Zuelus is so unlikely to be good. So unlikely. And this has judgment and no no physical attack. And good defenses. It might be too defensively inclined, if I'm being honest. But it could be a good tail glow mon. It's sacred gold. Okay, I have heard of that then. I'm not pivoting twice on Block Ranch. Yeah, same grass. It's the cock grass. Scout for other ability? I like drought. I like drought. No, LB. It's always good to hear the cope. My fucking dust snore that made it to red was completely copium at the start. It was a, it had a physical attack move set with special attacker status, and I made it all the way to red because I eventually got the good moves. Like the cope stories are the best. What's up, Giganto? Yeah, I want I want drought. I want drought. Weather abilities can have this silly. I think I'm down with this. Yeah, we can't run the chandelier. It learns no moves. Not good enough attack. No setup move. The moves are kinda garbo. Chip away steel wing, like what am I gonna do with that? Normal and steel, no way. Huge coverage. Yeah, attack headbutt Whitney. Horn attack, sorry, yeah. Even better. Yeah, survival, at least you had PP with that. Yeah, this thing might be... I don't think this is gonna have any special attack or speed. Damn. Eh, I mean, I expected it when I scouted those defenses. I was like, yeah, that... It's probably got too much defense. Okay, so it is sacred gold. Yeah, I have heard of that. I just don't know what the... I don't know what the goal of it really is. This way less was the answer. This is a tail glow mon, but it doesn't have speed either, so... Really? They didn't completely fix the level curve? That's actually kind of wild. I'll never evolve as Wayless. Machamp wiggles more than his pecs. There's, uh, there's a wonderful... Long-term Kaizo player goes by Ice Twig, who had an animated emote slot on Twitch filled with Machamp's crotch area swinging from this game's animation. It was just the zoom in, and eventually it was removed. <laughs> eventually, it got reported. But yeah, it's this—it's this game's Machamp animation with his crotch bulge swinging, whatever. It's true. It does do that. It said straight from Nintendo, man. They, you just made an emote straight from Nintendo's assets and put it on here. Holy shit, what the fuck? Dude, is that pure power? Wait, do I want this road up right now? Did you see that? God damn. I know tackles 50 power in this game, but that's level 5, man. That's fucked. <laughs> Literally, yeah, literally Nintendo graphics uploaded to Twitch and it gets removed. <laughs> That's just the funniest thing to me, like, Nintendo made that. Game Freak made that and it gets r reported on Twitch. <laughs> I love that shit, man. It's a fucking... 
amazing story. They are slower than shit. Oh shit. Wow, what the crap? It might be holding an item, to be fair. So I don't know its attack for sure. But if it's not holding an item, that did nothing. It probably is holding. And Nintendo's ass at... I might YOLO that road and I actually really am thinking about it, because that was ridiculous. I've done it before. I always get the base Rotom! I never see the forms! I've seen the base Rotom like three times more often than the forms. How is that real? There's five of the damn things. All right, hope you're doing well, Salakin, Wesley Piper. Customer, good to see you. Cork. Hello, Jeff, as well. Yeah, there's a scam train that just ended. It really wants me to get this. It keeps throwing me the 10%, too. Piper? You're a Piper. You know you are. Whatever. Oh my god. Dude! Oh, where's the attack, though? It's definitely got pure power. Or maybe it has fucking... No, it doesn't have a technician. How did the other one do six damage with tackle? Am I losing it? Am I losing it? Bro, can you... Hello? Huh? <laughs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? Get me out of here, please. Holy shit. What the hell? <laughs> Shell smash earthquake? No, I'm gonna die. Ditto. What is that? What did that other one have? How to do six with tackle? Oh my god, I'm gonna. I. Okay. How the fuck did it do that? I, I actually think it's got huge power or technician or something. Like, there's nothing else it could have, I think. Unless it... No. Yeah, that's it. That's all it could have. Rotom Wash with Hydro Pump Thunder. Must have Drizzle, too. Really? Pump Pound Eyes on that just wins the game. Not enough PP, though. I'm scared about Charged Stone Cave when I get there, but... I guess I don't have to clear everything. I'm going for the technician one. I want this Rotom. Why does Rotom base form always get the best looking shit? Pissing me off, man. What's up, Water Dragons? Oh, this game makes it easier? So it's reputations from Black 1? I didn't know that. I thought it was just unanimous. I had no idea. And it must be because of required trainers, too. I did not know it was easier in this game. Not that I really care. It's still like 25. It's still like 24 Pokemon or something. Oh, there's Team Plasma, of course. Yeah, re required fights. Show me the Brodom! Show me the Carfax! Alright, give me the Brodom. Galvanize. Uh, come on. That did a lot more. Did a lot more than Heart Stamp did. Even though it's the same power. <laughs> That's kind of weird. Twist Mount. I'll, I'll figure it out when I get there. I ain't gotten nowhere. <laughs> I just died to some random smart AI ranger on Route 20 once I had Surf. I gotta get there first. What's up, Giant? Unrunnable champ. We're going for a Rotom base form because I'm coping. But also, he's kind of good, so... Really want to really check it out. 
Those rangers, they were smart AI for sure, I could tell. I could tell. The level 3 is outspeeding me, man. And it's pissing. Sucks. Alright, I'm gonna need you to use... Tackle. That's not what I wanted you to use. Alright, do you have weak armor? I, I don't know. I don't know if it has another ability. Bro, I got- damn it. Ugh! What do you mean double crit, you fuck? You have stab Thunderfang? I have to get it. I just have to get it. I'm dead, but I have to get it. God damn it, dude. It fucking has- it fucking has it, doesn't it? Thunderfang doesn't matter for Technician, though, so maybe I just don't care. I'm dead, though. Come on. Alright. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Let's see what happens. The crits are not good. Those crits... It only has, like, base 12 attack, so it needs Shell Smash, and it needs defenses, which it's just not going to have. 440 BST is not going to do it. Whoa. <laughs> okay, weird. Weird. Didn't expect that. Weak armor on this is not good. Not a good ability, unfortunately. But we'll try to run it, because there's not anything else here. Uh, that's not good. <laughs> well, you know, it's pure power eligible. 417. <laughs> God damn it, dude. <laughs> Why do you have to have stab test moveset? Stab Thunderfang and Earthquake, man. Oh, I wish I had, uh, I wish I had adaptability, maybe. I don't know what else would make this good enough. No, I, I've had... During the start of Blue's Day, we had an average 4.5 IV Steelix. <laughs> Went from 510 to 477. <laughs> and then we also had a, a, a worse... Uh, there was another one that was worse than this with like 6 and 6.8 or something. So this one is really bad, but it's, it's bottom 5, but it's not as bad as those from Bonds where you got on, uh, Halloween. Your notifications keep turning off? What? Twitch is trying to kill my channel. I applied for Ambassador and they saw my- they saw what I do and they're like, oh my god, we need to get rid of this guy. I'm walled! How's it going, Antonius? Dingle Wampus? I never ran a Shell Smash mod. I wanted to. Nothing like having six defense. And then four defense once once I get hit by weak armor. Uh-oh, stinky. It's fine. It's not fine. It's not fine at all. I love my Giga Chad glass cannon. <laughs> Look at this thing, dude. It's a glass cannon I have. Classic imposter. Do you know if JoJo ran imposter lock or was he just playing? What did JoJo run? Dude, what the fuck? This is ridiculous. Do you see this? What the fuck is happening here? This Pokemon is stupid. Yeah, Shell Smash Imposter. I mean, what do you do? Even if I don't Shell Smash, 
and it uses Earthquake, I just die anyways. <laughs> Need Levitate. This Pokemon is stupid. Icicle Cock, man. Dice to... Dice to Freeze Shock. <laughs> Dies to everything. Cool, so the only stream wins are not Imposter Locked. I like that. I'm glad Imposter Lock didn't really take over. It's interesting, but whatever. I like universality more. Like, the defenses aren't even bad on this. This is a good-ass Pokemon. Fuck. I don't know if I should sell Shell Smash or not here. Probably, but... I don't need to, actually, because this has no speed. It might have really good defense. It did learn to move. It can't hit ghosts, so like... It did learn to move, though, so it might be able to hit me now. I'm not gonna do it. it can. Of course, it's against my defense. What happens? Oh, physical move. <laughs> physical move, but it's a fucking move that hits my defense stat instead of my special defense. That's so funny, man. No! Oh, wait. You're stupid. <laughs> Sorry, just let me have my aneurysm, and then I'll figure it out. Alright, so I do die to a crit. Oh no, I don't. Yeah. He should throw. Just gotta go for it. Yeah, he's throwing. Fucking rode him, dude. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my. <laughs> Why do I like this Mon so much? Let's test it again. I just want to see if that was a bad pull or something. Yeah, I mean, it was a kind of bad pull. It's it's a little better now. After fighting two Pokemon, that's fine. So it's gone up a bit, but it's definitely below average. And, I mean, it could be really far below average just because of the special attack, too. So it's not like it's too bad. The special attack could be bringing it down quite a bit. Do we have appliance emotes? No, we don't. <laughs> How's it going, guys? We still have 10 minutes of no pre-rolls. Make sure you guys get in before no pre-rolls. Glad to see you all here. What the hell is this Rotom? In Black 2, we're gonna have to have the Hall of Fame have all the different Rotom forms. <laughs> Christ. Well. Whatever. Whoa. What the hell? Oh, I should have done Earthquake. Oops, that was a throw. Somebody needs to do that cry for Phil's custom <laughs> ROM. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Alright, new move. Sweet cock. Dude, this Pokemon is so good. What the heck is wrong with me? Holy shit! Sorry. Look at this thing! Yeah, <laughs> I love it. I love this Rotom. I hate that it has weak, weak cock, but like, whatever, man. I don't even care.
What a pole. And we left this Wayless behind for this, too. I, I do wonder what this Wayless had. Speaking of Wayless, a Bonberry moment. Because it does interest me. Zwayless, the second... Or... Hydreigon, the second pseudo-legend with no quad weakness. Until, well, in this game, at least. Shouts to fairies. Fairies! Fairies! Furries! Oh my god, we got something for grass? Like, the grass-type coverage? That was such a good pickup. This is actually a sick Pokemon. Okay, I'm gonna stop saying that. This is a sick Pokemon. This is how to make a 440 BST mon viable. Now if I had 100 more BST, and all of it went into attack, we'd just win the game. Just saying. Like, imagine that spread. Like, it'd just be broken. Bro, thank you for the raid! Coverage! Thank you for the raid, Crow. How's your stream? Welcome, welcome. Imposter one-shot? It probably will with Earthquake being a thing, but, you know, whatever. We do what we can. We do what we can. Elixir's nice. I don't think I'll need it, but it is nice to have. I pulled a really cool Rotom. Base Rotom. I wish it wasn't a base Rotom, but, like... What can you do? <laughs> Make this into an alt form Rotom and it just slaps the cheeks straight up. Slap. Return to Cinder. Got to make a raid message. Happens to me all the time. Except I always just default to Wowie Boy. Thanks for the raid though. Hope your stream went well. I just started today. This run is really cool. It's the second one today. And the first one I died to lab, I'm pretty sure, so... This is all we got, and we're going to Charon with it. I love it. Got me... It took me a long time to get going today, and I haven't been speeding up as much, so... Second attempt, and it get, takes me an hour to get to Charon. Because I was pivoting a lot. Makes sense. Uh, other news for those of you joining now, since we're nearing the one hour mark before the pre-rolls get in. If you weren't here at the start of the stream, you didn't hear. I am confirmed on the 29th of this month, which is a Friday, at 10 p.m. Eastern U.S. time, to be running for um, GDQ Hotfix. It'll be Animal Crossing City for Gold Net. A race with Drew Pag. So you'll get to enjoy a City Folk Gold Net run on the GDQ channel. Epic. That honestly has bad. That equal that. Equal that. Looking forward to it. It's gonna be sick. And because of that, the most relevant news to you guys, besides the run happening, is the fact that I'll be doing all the the alt streams now this month will be uh, practice for that. So we'll do a, a bunch of city folk gold net on the alt stream. I thought I was gonna do Toadstool Tour or Kirby maybe. Only a little bit of Kirby, though, because it hurts my head now. <laughs> but it uh, looks like it's going to be Animal Crossing instead. Which is cool. Yeah. Yep, Racing Groove. I mean, we're first and second place in the category, and we've done a... We've done a race together, a community, community-wide race before. What the hell? In, in which he won. And that was like third or fourth or something. There were a bunch of JP runners in that one. It was a lot of fun. Now we get to do it one-on-one -on -one for GDQ with commentary and a new layout as well. It's going to have a sick layout. We're already working on it. Chair and Pred, open now. Gamble if you'd like to, as we near an hour. First Pred of the day, an hour in. Will we beat Charon with this Rotom? Which is really cool. We're going to have to shell smash on Charon, so it's going to be very uh, dangerous. I'll do what I have to. I honestly should shell smash before it too, and just rely on heals to get through. 
This mod just needs enough heals to get through Charon and Roxy before I get the guaranteed ones. That can boost me along badges 3 and 4 pretty easily. The fifth badge is gonna be iffy though. So, really need some luck. We'll have citrus berries there, but... Need some luck for that one. So, it's really the early game for this Rotom that's gonna be dangerous. Nope, Golden Net gets catches all the bugs one time. That's what we'll be running. There is paying off your debt categories, but it'll be Golden Net. Golden Net's the only category I care about, personally, besides maybe all Golden Tools. I thought I was gonna run that a long time ago, before Pokemon blew my channel up. And it didn't happen. I do want to do that one day, but it's such a huge undertaking. We'll see. At our goal, Soul Silver go, exclamation point PB. I really like it though. I want to go back to it. I want to go back to it. What's up, Woda? Hope you're doing well, Hermes. And Snowy. Oh yeah, Heart Cold Soul Silver is also a thing. <laughs> what up? Not much. We're 50 50 on the front. Not much. Sand and I just uh, tried a new pizza place today. Some of you who are in the Twin Cities. Is there anyone in the Twin Cities here right now? I know there's some people here who are outside of the Twin Cities, but are in the state. Whoa, that is so loud. Squashy! Thank you for the two-month resub! There we go. On the Prime. Welcome back. No Twin Cities viewers? Let's go. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, let's avoid the Shell Smash here. Let's go to Ouroboros. One shot. Yes. I know, I know where you're at, Hermes. They really call it the Twin Cities? Snowge. No, it sounds like you're memeing. They don't call it that. That's a meme. Aha! Spotted. Meme spotted and identified. Giga chat. Wicked. Thank you again, Squashy. It's feeling. I'm gonna try not to use Shell Smash again, although it'd be a really good idea here. I can feel the second mod in this fight being a legend. But if I can... Ah, oh, shit. If I can not take damage, that'd be great. I'll get my miss out of the way, because it's just setting up. Honestly, I might like to have Home Claws more than Shell Smash. That kind of sounds weird, but, like, I have good speed. And it's not a legend, so... This is actually a perfect gem so far. That's epic. Coil would be pretty... Actually, yeah, Coil's just better than Home Claws. Especially with weak armor. Fuck yeah. I want coil. That's the move. Alright, here we go. One shell smash is all we need. I ain't doing more than that. We need a tank a hit. Then we're down two, probably, with weak armor. Ugh, I knew it. Could feel the Deoxys coming. Deoxys! Deoxys! God damn it, Charon. No outspeed, at least. I oh, doubt that it really matters. Oh! Let's go! Uh, it's not great, but it's something. Oh, fuck off. Oh, that's actually not bad. That's actually not bad, but it, it wasn't physical anyways. over. I lose. He needs to defense curl again, but I don't think he's gonna... X defend. I don't, I don't have anything. Ah, don't burn. What's the chance to burn on this? 30.
Rats. Couldn't do anything. Fucking chair and always has a legend. Come on. Damn it. God, it's so annoying, man. Why do you have this? That's such a good mon. I had to shell smash. No shell smash and we were dead anyways. There's nothing I can do. I think the only way out of that was shell smashing twice. Nope. Even then I'd be dead. I'd need a crit or a flinch or a fully para. That's the only way to win that. Man, that sucks. Hurricane, Lucky Cock, Psycho Cock, Present, Magically Met. This is trash. We already had the- I knew it, dude! It was pure power! I knew it! <laughs> oh, I would've ran that shit, man. Look at this pure power spread. I absolutely would have ran that. I don't give a crap. Look at that. Dude, I would have ran that. What was the gym TMs? Thundershock. Steamroller? So he could have learned Steamroller. As the fourth of a shell smash. I 100% would have ran it. I know it's illegal, but who the fuck cares? Who fucking cares? It's a base Rotom. Nobody's winning with this. It would be... It would literally be... Look, level with me. This is a 440 BST mod, right? 440 BST. If you ran huge power on this, you'd have 103 more attack. That's a 543 BST mod. Is 543 illegal? No. No, it's not fucking illegal. Just get a mag mortar. Just get a good dust nord. Like, it doesn't do anything except make the game more fun. Obviously, I would, I would just run pure power, and anybody who says it illegal, I would just take a big fat shit and throw it at them. I'll get my license suspended for content. It's actually worth it. It's actually worth it. Look at that moveset right there. God, what a massive chad. Rules are for nerds. If I had huge power, I could have beaten this Deoxys. <sighs> All special attack, man. There's nothing I could do there. Arg, dude. What else do you have? Victini, of course! A fucking course he would! What else would he have on a good run? But 5 billion legends with 5 billion BST. Oh, yes! And Blissey, with Thick Fat. I don't get it. <laughs> Why? Why does it happen? Why does it happen? I was gonna earn that XP, dude. I was gonna be level 50 billion out, out of this fight. Oh, and yeah, Roxy leads with an Ninkata! Haha! <laughs> Rimmeraid! Crobat, which we could one-shot. Pidgeotto. Soulcock. Link. <laughs> uh, that sucks. No, his worst mon was what uh, the Pikachu. It was just a Pikachu, just thrown in there because he can. Congrats, doubters. Although that's a really shitty win. Whatever. Attempt two hundred. Here we go. That was a really, really interesting run. I enjoyed it. I would have ran the huge power. I really wish I scouted for it. I would have ran it and had fun. Look the. I make my rules... Oh, I need to make new attempts here. Oh yeah, it's Wayless. I'll look at that. Hold on. I'm making new attempts now. It is, uh... What? <gasps> it's attempt 200, so I gotta make some new ones, because they take a long time to load. So let me get this going now. Thank you for your patience. There we go. 
All right, yeah, let me open the, the Zuelas up. I forgot to look at that, but that was a Rotom run through and through. I already run um, huge power on 425 BST mons and lower in heart gold. So, like, if you were to apply the power creep to this game, 440 is not entirely unreasonable, especially with the analysis we just had. Yep, it had shield dust, 118 special attack, so it didn't have any speed. That's kind of what we scouted. Add Weather Ball, Mud Bomb, Thunder, Acid Spray is okay, Aurora Beam. And it goes into Bisharp! <laughs> really? That was a less than 1% chance. <laughs> it was a Dink Donk, man. <laughs> oh. God, an even Steven Dink Donk. Wow. Well, that was a run. I wish I ran the huge power room. Yeah, I wish I ran that now. Fuck. That would have been a super fun run. I would have ran it, man. Dang, I would have had fun with that. Why didn't I... Why didn't I scout for pure power? Oh, I'm mad at myself now. I would have loved that. Would have actually been super good. Because it would have... Not only would it have been fun, it just would have gone against the grain. I like going against the grain. People get too uppity about pure power and that dog shit rule. So... Would have just been fun, man. It's a totally viable mod to get that spread on a Magmortar. Just fun. On an Arcanine, Togekiss, Volcarona. Like, why aren't these other Pokemon just like that? Some of them are, sca are stoners, but there's plenty of Blissies, Kingdras. Yeah, Machamp was going to die on that one. I got unlucky, but I was kind of going for it. Yeah, that's right. That's fine. I was kind of going for it. That's true. It's unforge. Yeah, seems to be a trend because I like breaking the rules, huh? Alright, Pokemon with the highest spice tolerance. We're gonna try this again. Kaizo Cop, you didn't get it in in time, Seelan, unfortunately. I gotta hold on to that one, though. Alright, highest spice tolerance. Skitty. Whimsicott, which I think is the lowest. Or Scolipede. Chat's probably gonna say Scolipede. I think it's Scolipede, do. Two. Blah. It's probably Scolipede, yeah. You think Skitty has the highest one? Why, though? It doesn't make any sense. Scovillepede. Those who least expect it, true. <laughs> that is funny. And these Pokemon are trying to do something today, but they're all special defense monsters. Scoville, Scoville Pede is pretty funny. I will take it because of that. <laughs> Definitely munching on some Reapers. Some... Some, uh, Bootjalokia. Spice causes cats to puke? Well, that sucks. Bugs just don't have receptors for capsaicin. <laughs> Bro, come on. Is it still disabled? Wow. Dude, it's still trying to use Frost Breath. I'm gonna die to it. Use something else, you cock. Good lord. I love Scolipede, too. Scolipede's kind of the new legend that's come through on Gen 5. Alright, Largest Teeth is up next. We're on 201. I'm, I'm like 30 runs into the new generation. So this is, the, this is the new seed just now generated. We'll see what it's got. New seed just generated. Freshly generated. You couldn't handle the chill. Randomization complete. 
what do we got? Uh, custom trainer class, Kaizo Cup. That'll be in at 250 and beyond. It's a pretty good one to have. Less cursed seeds. That Rotom was not cursed. It was gonna be super fun. God damn it. I'm so mad about that. <laughs> Dang it. Ah. Alright. Largest teeth. Big teeth. No teeth. This is probably gonna win. Yeah, you ain't got teeth. Dugong! Lucario in the 50? We'll see. We got a chandelier right at the end there. Alright, we got a mixed attacker, no D. Man D. One glass- Ah, oh, are you kidding me? One glass cannon coming right up. What? Okay, he threw. Foggers. Get any blue candy for Halloween? I didn't go out. So, no. I was sitting right here doing Blues Day and raising $2,000 for charity, which was pretty good. Wake up, cock. Blue mustard. No, I wasn't exactly blue. Came out just fine, actually. Thanks for asking. How's it going, finally, Tree? Hope you're all doing swell today. Welcome, welcome. Over, Just over an hour into the stream. It feels like it just started. These things just go so fast now. <laughs> we grow up so fast. Anyone get the legendary double watermelon and Suica game? Any gamers in the house? What are we what are we chatting about here? Chatting? What yeah, what are we chatting about? Thank you, Robot House, for chatting for six months. Chatting. Thank you, thank you. Alright, fine, I'll look at Clang. Ten. Ten is not quite runnable, I think. It's probably about 16 at 6. 15 or 16. What happens if they touch? It clears the two watermelons and your board is reset, basically. Besides what other things are on there. Raze was close to getting double watermelon? Wow, he's getting really good then. What was the score? That's why people have 7,000 score. They successfully cleared two watermelons, and then they get their board reset and try to do it again. If you can do it two times, then you get to the ten thousands. But nobody has done nobody has done that in the entire world yet. But people only like a hundred people have done it once. It's really fucking hard. You're around thirty-seven to thirty-eight hundred score when you combine the two watermelons. So that's how you know when somebody's close to doing it when you see their score. To me, it's like a it's like a perfect game, and nobody's playing it for that reason. Nobody seems to know, even though tens of thousands of people are watching Suica game and playing it and buying it on their Switches on the Switch store. It's the second highest selling game on the North American eShop. Yet nobody seems to play it with this objective in, uh, in mind of clearing the two watermelons, even though that's actually 
the end game, the world leaderboards. Why is nobody doing that? Everyone's just like, oh, I want a watermelon. Oh, I want a 3,000 score. Like, bitch, no you don't. Go for the actual fucking thing that is impressive. Like, go, go for the thing that barely anybody has managed to do. If you get lucky and do it, you got, like, YouTube videos of people actually doing that. There's, like, a handful of them out there. They have millions of views on accounts that have, like, 600 subs. Because it blows up in the algorithm. I've seen Japanese videos, Japanese users upload videos. And they're, they have millions of views, hundreds of thousands of views. Because they're doing this ultra-specific thing in this game that's barely, barely attainable. And nobody seems to know about it, except for the million people who watched it. But I think it's all in- I think it's all Japanese audience because the game is even more popular over there. They're gonna host a tournament for it. Like shit, man. I don't understand Suica game and the mass audience of it missing the point entirely. It's really funny, I'll say that. It's really funny, and I'm happy to introduce people to what that game's actual objective is. Uh, that's pretty horrible. I am probably dead. Just have to have it, hope it has no special defense. It's Suica game. Oh, come on. Spare me! Oh! <laughs> Why did it do that? 90 Ack or Aftermath? Which one will it have? Sand attack. They pay. It, they play it for aesthetics, but like they're such a very. They're such a cool, barely attainable end game. You know why it's so cool to me? Because it's just like Kaizo. How many people have beaten Heart Gold Soul Silver Kaizo with a streamed run? Like thirty people, tens of thousands of impressions, hundreds of thousands, millions of impressions, even with Pi and big streamers playing it now. Fire Red Leaf Green is a little bit more attainable than Suica Game Double Watermelon, but Heart Cold Soul Silver Kaizo is a little bit less attainable than Suica Game Double Watermelon, per, you know, the number of people who have looked at it, tried it, attempts, and so forth. Maybe it's equally so, I don't know. But, shit, like, that very barely attainable in-game goal is perfectly manufactured in that game. And it's got great aesthetics on top of that. That's why it should be popular. Yet somehow it is not popular because of that. And we're not yet at least. It is in Japan, but not yet here. It's wild to me that that game is sitting in that state and is so uber popular without that extra thing of the barely attainable double watermelon. Yeah, he had one watermelon. Most people have gotten to that point. It's fun to get to that point, but like, when you actually see the potential as long term, shit. There's a Japanese person on YouTube who was streaming it, and I, I just like scrolled through, I moused over the VOD to see the, the thumbnail essentially. And there were like four games in three hours where he was very close to the double watermelon. That guy knows how to play. And then there's Amsa, of course, professional melee player. He's the melee Yoshi guy. He's a legend at Suica, but he hasn't even gotten the double melon yet. Yet he has the. Uh, here's another thing: he has the speedrun record for getting a watermelon and a speedrun record for getting 3,000 score. Right? So he has the speedrun records for that. You'd think with someone like Ludwig playing it constantly, Ludwig, 20,000 viewers on YouTube, playing it constantly for days. Ludwig also associated pretty heavily with the Smash community and the speedrun community. Ludwig knows all about speedrunning. No, there's like 24 people who have submitted a run. What? How is this game not fucking blowing up with the speedruns? Blowing up with the double watermelon? Like, my- I don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand what's happening. Like, 
I think that the speedrun could go could blow up. Yeah, it's just spamming it, but like who gives a shit, dude? There's actually some strategy. There's a lot of strategy. Uh let's see. So I think there's I think there's just like this untouched gold mine in Suica game with the so many impressions that it's getting, yet it has almost nobody on the speedrun leaderboard. The moment someone like Lovewood starts speedrunning it for real, just does like a hundred attempts, you know, spam dropping it and so forth, and then maybe trying a little bit of strategy. It, it, like, it's right fucking there. He's already spent hundreds of hours on it. I swear he's going to, like, it could just blow the fuck up. Yeah, it's like this, it, everybody's just approaching it like a rage game and so forth. But it, that potential, man, and I could be, I could literally sit here right now, knowing this, and just go get my fucking Switch, and then... Switch over to the AD HDMI uh, source here and start speedrunning the damn thing. You know, I can be there before it blows up, essentially. If they were to push it that direction, it can. It wouldn't be the whole audience, no. And a lot of people would deem it stupid because you're just spamming until they realize there's skill involved. But, um... I could do that. Yeah, there's... Oh shit, don't kill me. Oh, are you fucking serious? Oh god. No way, dude. This thing's min maxed. Okay, please catch. I thought that I thought for sure that was gonna kill me. 200 power move, 16 defense. Okay. Nice. This might be really good. Techno Blast didn't do as much as I wanted it to. I did 20. Expected. I'm expecting 23 special attack. I want it to be slightly higher than that. If it's like 26, this is runnable. Yeah, damn. It's just not good enough. It was so close, too. Dang. Can't believe the attack was minimum. <laughs> Capture rates are increased in Black, White, Kaizo, yes. Uh, in Heart Gold, at full at full health with no status afflictions, it's 33% with the base Pokeball. In this game, it's 44%. However, there's also some other differences. The Quick Ball catch rate is not 100% in this game on the first turn. I thought it was. In Heart Gold, it is. It's Master Ball. So there are some of the special balls that got altered. I don't know exactly what to, but... There's a li there's a bit of a difference, and it's a little bit more likely at full health with the regular Pokeball in this game, but it's not 100%. This Blastoise is trashed. <laughs> Uniformly? Oh yeah, in Kaizo the catch rate is maxed. So it, it's the max catch rate boost provided by the Poke Rando application that isn't just auto-catch everything. Because the game would be stupid without that, since you're catching fully evolved mons. So it's set to every Pokemon, they all have the same catch rate. 33% at full health in Heart Gold. Does that do half? What happens? Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ugh. What the fuck? That is the worst Pokemon I've ever seen. Truant with zero defense. Okay, man. We're out. We're out. So yeah, that's how Kaiser kind of works. One is almost two. Chatting. So yeah, I, I don't know. Maybe I'm just blowing smoke, but... It is possible for this week of game speedruns to actually blow up. I find it really accessible because people can just see they do that for content. It's still rage content too if you speedrun and it doesn't go your way. Or some shit gets yeeted off the top and ends your run. I think it could be really good, it's just not touched right now. I, I see potential in something that hasn't happened yet, which is pretty rare.
on a platform like this. But probably nobody cares. Because it hasn't happened yet. <laughs> Once it starts happening, a lot of people will probably know about it. Or maybe it just won't happen. Let's see if there's anything here. It's too wholesome to speedrun. That's just not true. Whale Lord, my first PB, man. It should be something that's at GDQ. Wait a second. AGDQ second submission period, November 20th to 27th. Six, I'll take it. This is a good mod. Let's get it. <sighs> What's up, Adam? You're lurking and ready for Star Fox, huh? <laughs> six damage with super effective Thunder Shock, 29 special defense, six eighths, three fourths of 29 is roughly 22. So, 22 special attack? Twenty-nine might have enough speed. Ah, uh, it was runnable. This is super good, man. <laughs> that was actually a totally good Pokemon. Not the best moves, but like you learn 14 more. The spread, the, the special attack wasn't as high as I hoped, but it was within a range. 19 to 24, I guess, is where I could have placed it. I just went with the middle of the range. It's gonna suck if it had two abilities, but there was no way I could know. Last I said 35 speed. What was I gonna do? I don't know. I don't know if I can get this past Charon to get to Verbank. I doubt it, but it is tanky, so... It's got bulk, so maybe I can do it. Just really not good. Wow, can I have that? Nah, actually, I don't want that. <laughs> eh, it might be over. I don't see how we get through this. What the fuck is that moveset? Yeah, I did, uh, I did chemistry, of course. Damn. Ah! Shield dust! Really? Oh, no. Dude, come on! What? Fucking hell. Alright, rock polish, double hit, miracle eye, power trick, heart stamp, arm thrust, avalanche, ice shard, twin needle, fall swipe, dual chop, triple kick, conversion to flame. Not a single move. At all. No moves. Alright, well, shit. That was an interesting mod, but yeah, never got moves. Shield Dust. If we got Shield Dust, it would have just been a 
really sad run when we just never learned a single move. Dang. Dang. Ugh, oh, these are heartbreakers so far today. <laughs> oh my god, man. Heartbreaker runs. Yeah, if you want to talk about chemistry, you should talk to Orbori. He could help you even with, um... I bet you could help you if you're struggling as a chem student, for sure. The scientist that knows their field versus a scientist who is in a different field and has, you know, experience with chemistry, because I had to do it in undergrad and high school for my degree. So, like, I need to know chemistry. I know atmospheric chemistry, essentially. But, um... Perhaps Ourobori can help you more. It's very hev very heavily memory based, I'd say. Oh man, that was ridiculous. Heartbreaker runs so far. These are definitely good content. The most pink Pokemon. <laughs> most pink. Oh Kim! Yeah, oh Kim, oh my goodness. Okay, no pink. No pink. No pink! I think this is the most pink one because it has a red-ish nose. It's kind of pink. Any questions? Yeah, it's probably slow. It's just barely pink. You 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 talk you you say it's Orgo? Why they call it Okim at UNCA? Everybody called it Okim and Pekim as well. Isn't that its mouth? I don't want to think about that. What's up, MVP? Ah, there we go. Quantitative analysis chemistry, of course. <laughs> Chatting. What does this do? Lynch. Well, not gonna be able to do that, but... Maurice! He's stabbing my ball. Oh, come on. No throw move, I guess. <sighs> Ampy pass clay? Damn. Do you run imposter luck? I think I asked that already. Nobody does. Pretty much nobody does. I run sub 300 BST Pokemon 0.0% of the time. No! How have I still not won? I've been so close. I've been so close to winning the lab. With like a Kleffa and shit like that. But how have I not won yet? That's ridiculous. I had a Ditto Lab win. Hmm. Maybe, maybe I ended the run before I died on that one. It doesn't really matter. Silliest, silliest Pokemon. All right, the silliest Mon. Ah, uh, chat's gonna blame me if I don't take Shedinja. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, fine. The silly. Get a moody flame charge charge beam? Oh, that's kind of sick. Why is this thing like... Why is this thing trying? Dude, I need to replace Rock Blast and then I'm imposter immune. Heal order? No way! Heal order on my one HP mod. <laughs> Huge. All right, he doesn't have anything. He doesn't have anything. This is my first sub 300 win for Ditto. So first sub 250 win. He doesn't have it. It's fuck boy chat. Why is this Shedinja like good? You see this? It's dude. 
<laughs> it's a 50 50. Fuck you! Oh, it's stupid! Let's go! <laughs> That's cheating! No way, dude. That's cheating. That's cheating. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck, man? 90% act, man. Get the sh get the fuck out of here. Cheating. That's crap. That's fucking crap, and you know it is. Oh wow, abilities Wonder Guard and Wonder Guard. I wonder what else we'll get. Wonder Guard. No. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> That's cheating. I know. I know. Imposter keeps the HP. I just forgot because I'm dumb, I guess. I I'm dumb because I forgot. Of course it had imposter. I should have checked if it had a I, I should have checked if it didn't have imposter if it would have had coverage. That would have been funny. I don't care anymore then. Yeah, imposter copies ability. Only thing it doesn't copy is the freaking HP stat. That's literally it. Most hellish? Haha. <laughs> uh, no, that's not illegal. Shoe on head for not pre recorded? True. <laughs> it's such shit. Thank you for the shed, imposter. Yeah, that's actually really funny. And of course, I got the three pack and then missed the second one. Like, of course that happened. Alright, let's go middle. I did deliver the silly. You're welcome. Bees. Pride Pug. I also chose math with meteorology, but I didn't finish the major. I was really close. Charge Beam Secret Sword. The moves of all time. I had two classes left to finish the math major. I didn't want to do them though, so I was like, fuck this. <laughs> I just didn't want to do them. At that point, I was like, this is not going to help me, and I don't care. I got what I needed out of math to that point. Kill me. What? How did that even get close? Ducklet, you fuck. Fucklet. Kaizo calculations? No. Analysis would not have helped me with Kaizo calculations. It would have helped me with writing proofs about my Kaizo calculations. Which I don't need to do. Because chat trusts me already. Otherwise they're bitch-ass shit chat, as per the game. Thank you for the clips, guys. Wow! Chat's clipping things? You guys have changed. Holy shit. This is a big evolution. <laughs> Chat cares about content again! Unbelievable. Prove it to us. You don't get to see the calculation. Do you have the calculations? You don't get to see the proofs. Those are different, my friend. Yeah, if moments were still a thing, I would have made that a moment. It's November 2nd, dude. We'd have six... We'd have five new moments. I'm gonna press it right now. Sorry, moments is no longer available. Thank you for participating in the beta. Ooh, silly. Silly! Guys, two sillies in a row. Tell me it happens. It... That's not silly. That's the opposite of silly. That's the anti-silly. <laughs> I was like, wow, that's so good if I have flash fire and drought. No way. <laughs> Let's see if it's two abilities. 
It might be the funny silly. So the silly is Flash Fire Caesar. The funny silly is Drought Caesar. <laughs> then we get outsped by a chlorophyll mon with searing cock. Can't wait. Sorry I didn't get my PhD so I was more attractive to my Twitch chat. I could still go back and get it. I I ran a shed in the lab and the rival had an imposter. Of course he did. Damn it, it looks like it's only drought. That's four for four, that's all drought. I'll probably I'll probably knock it off. Ow. Bruh. Why do we fucking have such crappy eyelashes? How how have we evolved to a point where eyelashes don't just not go in your eye and kill you? Like skill issue? Medicine? <laughs> okay, we have to click we have to keep the shitty eyelashes around. Oh yeah, this is good. I like that move, it's a lot of fun. Oh, you suck! You're so bad. No. I shouldn't have said anything. Slow start! Okay, it would have learned blue flare and drought. That way when I get impostured, I can hit be hit by drought blue flare. Quad super effective. I think that would have been a really good way to go. Any questions? Oh, Verizon. Wonderful we'll CT Mobile. I've had some good rants so far today. Suica game. There's a lot to talk about. Slow fart. What's up, Yuli? James, hope you're doing well. Guys, I really want to show you my fucking shiny bonnet and sleep that I just pulled today. Incessantly. Pokemon sleep, man. So sick. I, I have gotten to the point with Pokemon sleep where I even heard Caleb. Caleb Hart. Say, man, maybe I should check out Pokemon sleep. Just saying. I got influenced. <laughs> Zero to hero, man. Middle. Incessantly. Yeah, I had a sweet good game run. Yeah, well, it's not M4, but it'll do. It'll do. Transform. Kinda tired of this transform bullshit. <laughs> Imposter bullshit. Transform bullshit. Like, can we... Can I just play with and fight the Pokemon that are not me? Can I play as me and they can be them? And I can just, you know, have strategy instead of not having strategy? That would be really cool. Incessantly is such a good meme. We gotta take what we can from Twitch chatters like that. Chatting. Speed time. Oh, come on. Maybe I'll transform here so I don't have that. Probably not, though. Actually, the defense is okay. Don't do it! Don't be a ghost, I'm gonna kill you. Okay. No, I'm not into TF chatting. 
probably should have me first did for ghosts, but I just want to pivot on the first round. If I can't, then I'm dead anyways. I accept my fate. Let it be done to me as it is written in the Kaizo Iron Mon logs. <laughs> SMH. Boring over dramatic? Yeah, let me just win in a, with a really boring mod. I'm just guaranteed to win. Nothing can touch me. I don't know who the incessant guy is. Wow, there actually was nothing here. It's just some random chatter, I think. Some random lurker, probably, who is just like, I, I hate when this guy talks about. No, it was a new person. Remember that? It's just some guy who came in and is like, wow, I wanted to watch Kaizo Iron Man, but if we're just going to talk about Pokemon sleep incessantly the whole time, I'm out. Yeah, that's what it was. That was that was literally it, paraphrased. That was actually it. It was a new person. Or they claimed to be new. <laughs> no, it wasn't Tomas. Tomas is wholesome. That wasn't wholesome. Uh, yeah, there are six-figure Kim jobs. I think the majority of them are six-figure, probably. You should work at 3M here. Incessantly? Wait, this guy has a knit arena? He actually caught something from the first row. Wicked. Thank you, Zach. How's it going? Yeah, I came to watch him talk about Pokemon Sleep. He's just gonna talk about Kaizo incessantly. I know. Incessantly. Oh, don't do that, you dingbat. Oh my god, I almost threw. Yeah, Pokemon Sleep, Kaizo, Iron Mon. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that would be. I mean, that's starter, Mr. Raven, but there's definitely way... Way... There's definitely a big, uh amount of positions that you can at least work up into that have that in that field for sure i would say i would be surprised if not yes there's intro jobs and and so forth and adjacent jobs but it's not yeah and it depends on your degree too wow what a good mon sandstream gigalith good speed no defense. <laughs> Zero defense. What a terrible Pokemon. Levani with HP and speed? Hell yeah. What about the man's Levani I had before? It was completely a man's. Like 150 in both attack steps. <laughs> Just get a man's. I want to show you guys my fucking shiny Bennett, though. Ugh. Almost threw my phone when I caught that thing. Alright, back to the cock patch. Holy shit, that's ridiculous. Zero dead pixels with 1600 VR headsets that you have to test. That's ridiculous, Sam. What the hell? <laughs> you think that's one of those jobs where everybody tries to write it off as it being super cool, but then you actually see what it requires and you're like, what the fuck? This is horrible. Like, wow, I get to, t I get to test. I get to test these products, haha, <laughs> gamers. Alright, that Volibee is interesting, I guess. Cockturn. Not sure if this is the common or the 5%er. I it's slow as shit, whatever it is. 
Whatever it is, it's slower than dirt. <laughs> Swobie is interesting. I want to know if it has, uh, like, aerial ace or something. I could transform into it, actually. Should've done that. <laughs> what the hell am I doing? Transform. Transform you dingus. Cascoon's the common, so or Silcoon rather. So we did see uh, the, we did see one of the five percents. So I'll go for six out of seven here. Evo run. I know chat wants it. Our bitch. Ugh. There's nothing here. Maybe I'll use 16 speed to catch something better in this grass down here. Not really... Attack is half of its defense stat. I almost died. Why do you want more people to be IT auditors, Razor? Most curious about why you want your field to grow larger. I mean, it's good for, like, the benefit of everybody. It feels nice to have peers in it. Social reasons, but why actually? funny. <laughs> I don't know why that tastes like that. They got all the syrup settled to the bottom. Silly Dr. Pepper. Oh, guys, if you haven't seen yet, I can be a new cosplayer. Check this out. Maybe I'll make a pep shirt channel point redemption to go along with the pep hat. It'd be kind of cool. Have I think we could have both of them. It's a little harder to do that though, because then I have to wash it. I mean, maybe I won't wash it all that often. Dance game moment. <laughs> pep hat, pep shirt, man. I'm not a smelly person. I'm very hygienic. So, nothing bad will happen to the shirt. Shameless Dr. Pepper plug? I literally put the hat on my head all the time. What do you mean, shameless Dr. Pepper plug? Also, Ivysaur, Cyndaquil, I, uh, Squirtle. There a pep hat. Drago. There's one more mon here, and it's a 5% to show up. Probably, I'm going to struggle. There is nothing to pivot into except that Bullaby with D-Dance. This is looking like a really sussy run. I'm hoping to get a pep sponsor. Someone knows a guy who knows a guy. Just put that through the chain, man. I'm right here. I'm sitting right here. Very good, Drago. Yeah, did you see the shirt? Alright, so 5% to get the last spawn here. Guaranteed to be level 6, so... I'll grind for it. Nothing else in this seed is any good, besides possibly the last spawn that's also a 5% on Cock Ranch. So this is getting into Copium range already. Public accounting is understaffed. Industry offers very valuable service to businesses. Necessary compliance commitments to customers can have peace of mind. Wrong peace, but you have the peace of your mind. 
Makes sense. Any PBs on the Kaizo? Yeah, not too- I mean, I've only been doing this for three weeks, so we've had several PBs in that time. Current one is five badges into this game, which is... Technically over halfway through in terms of, you know, storyline, eight badges, and so forth. And also, you know, the reason I went to this game is PVing and Heart Gold Soul Silver, which... ...is winning. <laughs> Your grammar. Is that grammar when you get the- when you get a homophone wrong or something? Is that grammar, or is it just... Vocabulary. I don't think it's grammar. Yeah, I know. I was I, I hesitated to say it, LB, because there's so much post eight. I hesitated. <laughs> semantics? No, semantics has to do with connotation and so forth. And I guess I guess it could be because you're just calling out some things that are not really that important. That's also a kind of semantics. Homophobe. Nice, Zach. I don't know why people do that. That's unethical. Imagine being an unethical person. Any unethical people in my chat? My boyfriend is a is a near professor, an instructor of ethics. He teach he teaches courses on ethics and so forth. So you better watch out, cause he'll just ban you. There he is. Suck. All right, what's the suck got? Max elixir. Slow. Don't do that. Ten PP. <laughs> uh and not high special attack. Oh, I'm stuck. Catch and release. Yeah, my boyfriend is the suck. Are you doing blazing? And enter or and Johan, if I didn't say so. Huh? Smug. Smug is always the response to anything I ha farm. What will I do? What is it, Queen? What are you talking about? <laughs> what will I do? All right, well, Volaby and an unknown here. This is gonna be really annoying. Do we plan to get married? Probably. The gist is right now that we won't, we won't um, stress ourselves out with marriage until he has his PhD. Oh, the battle menu. Were you the opponent I was fighting? <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay. It's not exactly great, but... Is transform priority or something? I was out- I was getting outsped by this before. So maybe it has low- low attack. 
Oh, what will I do? Sorry. Yeah, I got you. What will I do? <laughs> I got it, Queen. Jeez. I just thought you were talking about yourself. It's right for me to assume... It's right for me to assume that you're being... Uh... Man, this thing is ass. Fuck! Everything sucks! Now I can't get away. But I outsped it. Does it have stop? No, as in today. What's happening? Speed tie? That makes sense. It's right to assume you're thinking about yourself. That is correct. I should do that. This is probably a dead seed. Yo, thanks, man. Appreciate that. The My only chance is... Um, whatever this last Pokemon is here. Or I can Evo run a Silicoon if I just want to go Copium. There's nothing else in this seed, unfortunately. So I could run- I could Evo run the Silcoon. <laughs> I mean, I should probably check the Silcoon's moves. That would be helpful. I thought the Bully Bee would be okay, but it has no attack. I've had a few perfect hair days in the last year. And the other 5% again. I need the last 5%er. Dang. Come on now. I've soared past the first gym. I mean. It's not gonna happen, I promise. <laughs> Unless Charon has five babies, it's, uh... Bad. Alright, what the fuck does Silicon have? Speed, holy shit. Oh my god, the moves of all time! What are you talking about? Man, air slash heat. Maybe we just do this. What the heck do we get? Anorith Larvesta? Full <laughs> beat Cricketune. Oh. Maybe we just do this. I don't. Ivysaur is just not. It's slow. It's bulky, but like. It, it's just not gonna do it. Alright, I'll run. Yeah. Shit. Fuck it. Larvesta with Stab Heat Wave? No! No, Silcoon! <laughs> oh. Oh, come on. Dude, this thing was gonna get Bone Club, though. Pure power Leafeon with no speed. Silcoon. Volbeat. Oh no. <laughs> well, I'm glad we didn't do that. That's no good. Charon? Grumpig. Sheer Cold Grumpig. Endeavor Grumpig. Dogatix Stab Relic Song. Magnazone. We had Double Kick for it. Meowth. Dude, we, what the f- How does Charon go from three legends and Blissey to this? Oh god, you're killing me in your game. What the fuck was that? Oh, it had Serene Grace, but it also had 19 base special attack. So yeah, let's just spam flinch and take like 17 air slashes to kill a single Pokemon. I love it. Galvantula, cool. We yeah, we've already had we already had a dude. I really, really wish I had gotten that Rotom with pure power. 
I just... I, I don't care, man. I don't care. I wish I could have had it. Like, it make to me, it makes sense. If you can get a Pokemon with pure power, and with that pure power applied to the attack stat, its base stat total does not exceed a Pokemon you can literally run. Like Magmortar. Like, if it doesn't exceed what is feasible, I don't understand why it's banned. It just doesn't make any fucking sense. Oh yeah, and then it had Mummy. That's right. We would have EQ'd it, though. I could have EQ'd it. So that wouldn't have made contact. I just don't get it, man. Like, why is that not the thought process? I, it, because Kaizo's not supposed to make sense. That's why. But, you know, I don't give a shit about that. I give a shit about content. And to me, that's logical. I like logic, I like content. I put those two together 100% of the time. Middle! I would have ran that right Oh. Well, that's uh, what they call in the business not good. Logical content. Really, Meow? Is it, like, more than a 10% difference? I get what they mean. I just don't know if it's more than 10%. Oh, it doubles IVs and EVs. Okay. But those are applied visually to your stats, so I don't understand why that matters in this case. Raw stat gets doubled, effective base stat is higher. That sounds worse than double. But it is applying the EVs and IVs, so... Two crits. Oh, well, we just have to get through one more. Shit. Good. So how would that apply to that Rotom I just had, then? Once I had IVs and EVs, EVs were maxed out, like, wouldn't I see the stat with those EVs and then that stat would be doubled versus the base stat? I'm still fine with that. Like, whatever visually is on the tracker is what would be doubled. It's not the base stat, because the base stat has been pampered with EVs and so forth, but like... Okay, floor, floor, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's not just paying attention to the base stat, but it would be visually represented on the tracker. That's- uh, everybody is like, thinking of it that way. They would be- there, if, if you're a visual learner, that is, you would be seeing the stat that is doubled, but it is oh, it is more than doubling the base stat. So like, I understand how that can lead to a much higher a effective base stat, essentially. But it doesn't mean it's impossible to, to you know, I I literally found the Archeops with 26 average IVs, and the effective BSD was over 600. That's legal. So... Like, 
getting that Rotom I just got with the perfect spread and the perfect moves with pure power, that's a one out of many thousands, many thousands, just like the Archeops with good IVs having 602 effective base stat total. I still don't understand why, well, I, I do understand why it's been because it doesn't make sense. But logically, I would say that that is a runnable mine. I logically, I'd say that's fair because you had to roll every single thing there. Even if it gets that little bit, not little bit, but even if it gets that more significant boost from pure power, still makes sense. Still makes logical sense to have a fun run out of it. Because it doesn't, it's not better than, you know, a Dusknor with another immunity or an immunity to burn. It's not, it's just not better than that. It's still very vulnerable. Still has a few weaknesses. It's still got bad defenses. <laughs> so. There are things that are much better. What? That did one? Don't know what's going on there. <laughs> Why'd that do one? Contrary? No, it wasn't contrary. It would have had a different sound effect. <laughs> the spin rack's going the whole way. Have a good night, Razor. It was higher than 210, and it still had, like, 30 in both defenses. <laughs> it was still horrible, and it almost died several times. It was an extreme glass cannon, because that's all it could be. That's literally all it could be, and usually those Pokémon are terrible. So not only did the Mobile roll a perfect stat spread, for what it needed to do. It also had, you know, like a top 1% lucky seed to be able to make it through, not die to any drops with Mach Punch and Vacuum Wave being a thing, and live on red several times. Like, it was still an incredible run. Which, I think the same could be true with that Rotom, especially given that Deoxys, I barely would have gotten past it. What did that do? Three? Uh. It's like plus or equals. I'm not sure which that is. I think it's I think it's around eighteen though. <laughs> Why do you have that, you stupid idiot dummy? Hell glow. So I I would have I've had a mon, I've had a Pokemon in Heart Gold that was incredibly similar to the, you know the post uh, calculation Mawile, because I had a Crobat with like base 250 attack and 120 speed and so forth. The, the max that could have is like 50 in both defenses with low HP and no special attack at all, right? So effectively, that's a really, really similar Pokemon. It had Stab, Drill, Peck, Low Kick, and so forth. And I had not a difficult seed, just one difficult Mon, Jirachi, that would, you know, just end me every time. And also, I couldn't get through a Parish Songer that was faster than me on Lance. I figured that out, too. So, like... You can get Pokemon like that without pure power, and it's just as likely to roll them. Because it's such a unique combination and spread and so forth. As something with pure power that's barely runnable like that. 
logically, I would run the fuck out of that every time. As a result. What's up, Rius? Diglett's the common. Link. Papa Gregus. I don't really want. I don't think it's a good mon. Darmanitan. Okay. Wish it was Zen instead. It is faster. One damage with Grass Pledge. Expected. Not really great special defense. Really just not good defenses, I would say. This is probably some sort of sweeper, I just don't know which yet. Maybe it's a glass cannon mixed attacker. If a different mon gets Zen mode. I don't really know how Zen mode works, but the moves are shared. So it can't get Zen mode, I guess. You you what is it? An ability? It's the ability, right? In that case, you can't get it, it's just a separate spawn slot. The the ability is not included in Kaizo then. It's just a, a different spawn slot for Zen mode, but the move set is shared with uh, regular Darmanitan. Unless there's a trainer that has the flag alt forms have... Don't have OG form moves or whatever. I don't know, this thing is... Yeah, this... Oh, that was a crit that time. Ugh. I don't know, they- both Darmanitan and this have, like, equal defenses. Equally bad special defense, at least. That I can test. The other one had much worse special defense, so this one looks okay. I don't trust it. I don't trust this being good at all. I don't think it's good. But also, I keep getting outsped by everything on this, and I don't think I'm gonna be able to find one of the 5% fast enough. I'm just gonna look at it, because it has tail glow. No, it is Root. I found one. I found a Zen mode that only had the regular moves. So it is shared. Because I got Frenzy planted by one and it was only on regular Darm. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, what the fuck? Dang. That sucks. So it wasn't low special defense, it was low HP. Ugh, oh, rats. I needed to swap the natures on this and it would have been runnable. I didn't think it was going to be runnable, but... I got suckered into superpower only doing three. I probably just kept finding a bad one. Damn. That's unfortunate. 30% increase? That's tailored with 255 EVs, right? You're just not going- 252, whatever. You're just not going to get that. You're just not. You're gonna get roughly equal EVs with slightly higher attack. It'll be like 130, 100, 130, 190, something like that. that that's too much, but you get what I mean. Oh, and if I forgot about HP. <laughs> Whatever. Ivy's like Lear mid. Oop, why am I going up here? Dang, I actually would have ran this. It's screw tail glow, but like... I would have ran this if I didn't get that damn nature. Fuck. I would have needed a plus nature for this to be runnable, but... So it probably wasn't going to happen, but I it was out of my wheelhouse. I thought it had, like, 16 to 18 attack, not 20 with the down nature. That was a misplay. But also, it was just a coarse calculation. I couldn't see. I couldn't actually tell it had higher attack than what I thought it did. Because it didn't have anything for me. It had quad-resisted moves only. 
10%. So 10% boost would make it after it's doubled, maybe 231 effective base stat and attack. It's not really, uh... No, it's really still viable. That's still achievable. I like the argument, though. Thanks for shedding light on it. Um, it was good to think about it in that light. And after thinking about it in that light, the result is I am going to run that pure power Rotom every time. Congratulations. We did it. Uh, slow start is not won anything. <laughs> I agree with your side. Oh, I lost two followers for that. Shit. The Kaizo cops are gone, guys. Finally. We did it. We upset them. <laughs> Lowest BSD in which game? It's funny, Meow, because after having so much exposure to the tracker, I was assuming it was doubled, you know, visually, and that's actually correct. It just wasn't the, uh... Wasn't the right way to think about it. Oh, shit. Alright, I need this to do... Nine. It did five. That means it could be a physical attacker. Actually, it means it's trash. It's gonna have, like, thirteen. Giant Chimeco without pure power, Mawile with pure power. Before, you know, with only the base stats. For Heart Gold. Yeah, Chimeco was a no guard, silly mon. This thing is so fucking bad. Fuck me in the butt. So unlucky, man. I didn't want to keep the Kafagurgus, though. There's just not enough attack. Would have been... Would have been stupid to run that. Yeah, the funny part is, even though it had no guard silly, uh... Yeah, it had two Oko. It didn't even have a good spread for no guard. Like, it wasn't that fast. It, it just kind of had, like, an even Steven spread. It was honestly pretty garbage. Really weird. <laughs> But it worked, just because of how broken that is. A tangled cock, man. I don't think we're going to make it through anything with this, but we got to try. <laughs> well, sh Jesus. Of course. What the fuck, man? Fog dance. No, it changes everything. It changes so much. We're going to win now with Steel Wing. Absolutely going to win now. Tough runs here. Uh, no sandbag, but I wouldn't just do 5 and 5. I would do, like, S tier and F tier. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, wow.
Sure, Trife. We'll look, we'll look. Uh, I don't remember the ability. Anticipation. Anticipate these nuts. I mean, if this makes it through fucking chair and like, what are we even doing anymore? Yeah, um, MVP made that. It was in the community. Challenge. <laughs> Alright, well, Will Wisp isn't gonna do it, so we're pretty locked in. Steel Wing. <laughs> It'll be great! Hope you're doing well, Fade. Anybody I haven't said hi to, welcome, welcome. If you watched pre-roll ads to get into the stream today, I appreciate you. Stick around, there's no mid-roll ads, so that's why you watch those. I do apologize, but... I wish I could run no ads, but no. If you're interested, and you're here now, if, if you're here now and you're interested in Animal Crossing City Folk uh, speedruns, Golden S speedruns, I'll be doing those on the alt account, as I have a GDQ hotfix race with Drew Pag on the 29th of this run, this month, rather. So that'll be pretty exciting. Oh, this guy juices, look at him. Oh, yeah. Oh! Damn! I don't know why they made the animation so good for fucking Pharaoh Seed, dude. That's okay, Fade. Yeah, if I can help make your day better, I'm always here for that. I'm always here for that. Mean cock. Sinning. Well, we do that all November long. Non-stop nut November. Sinning. Uh... Oops. Why are we gonna make it out of Charon with this? I can feel it. Started late? You don't have a perfect track record? Notoriety out the window. Sorry, I don't make the rules. Yeah, the Verbank pivots will be great. That's why I'm doing it. Uh. 
in shambles. It happens. Oh my god, what's this trainer? Speed Deoxys. Or attack at Deoxys, rather. Wow, that thing is scary. Physical sweeper. Yeah, first Rockmon to beat Charon, possible. What is it? What's what's the three I haven't won with? Rock. Psychic? What is it? Psychic and electric, right? Electric is weird. Rock, psychic, electric. I ha I have to run this. There's nothing else. I guess there's a quillfish on Route 19 that I didn't go back and look at. So I could have gotten back to the quillfish, but hey. Unless that is pure power. <laughs> Isn't that illegal, streamer? Streamer? Chatting? Isn't that illegal? Chatting. I only made it out of Charon 18 times. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, that's horrible. Well, fuck me. <laughs> that's less than 10%. I don't know what my Faulkner win rate was. I definitely beat Faulkner more than 380 times, right? Maybe not, honestly. Maybe not. <laughs> there were some days where I just didn't even fucking make him past at all. That's felt like more, yeah. We haven't been to Castalia that often, actually. <gasps> What's up, Gummy? Come on, just die, you stinky. Toasted tuna salad? That sounds amazing, actually. I haven't had tuna salad in forever. I definitely have it in sandwich form, though, if I were going to. Wow, that thing is definitely oriented a certain way in its stat spread. I think that crit was the only reason I killed that. Alright guys, Charon Pred number two today. In two and a half hours, it is one of those days for sure. Will I beat Charon? <sighs> God damn it, I wish I had that huge power road and we'd be at Berg right now. We'd be past Berg. I gotta see what Quillfish had, too. I'm curious. Man. Yeah, Charon's definitely harder than Faulkner. No, we would have made it through uh, Charon with the huge power. It would have been close, though. Oh. Actually, I don't know, because there were two more legends, but we would have been able to heal, so... I don't know. Wouldn't have been forced to heal on Deoxys, at least. 68% doubt, totally valid. Only 20 people participated in the Pred, though. You guys gotta look alive! Don't get to Pred as much in this game when I'm just stuck pivoting. It means more each time it happens. Good luck. You might be scared to doubt, but get used to doubting more often than Black, too. There's only 8 gems as opposed to 16, anyways. Why does Tornado Alley exist? Warm, moist air at the surface from the Gulf of Mexico. Uh, cold, dry air aloft because of air masses that come from over the Rocky Mountains. That equals instability. You get the right, uh, get the right turning of winds with height and you get tornadoes. Wow, that's a bad start. That was a really good D-drop, though. 
Happy to help go up him. You're playing Suica game? Nice. Enjoy. Other games online? Hey, I'm happy to be second monitor content. No. Fange, dude. I'm so toast here. I am toast. Oh, I have speed it. Uh, well, when Doom Desire hits me, it's over. It's not gonna do too much, I think, but... It's gonna be a little rough. Oh. 36 damage, maybe? 40. I think I lose here. Rotom Flan. I couldn't I couldn't see the Rotom Fan, dude. Wasn't was not good for me. <laughs> Spinning rack was cricket tune with compound eyes, not enough speed. River dance though. <laughs> Oh boy. Ah, uh, quillfish. Piece of shit. Oh yeah, alright, nothing there. Rotom Flan, yeah. Flan. Good job, doubters. Zero for two on Charon today. Yeah, average 524 BST is pretty bad. That is very true. And Charon himself does not have to be average 650 base stat total either. But he fucking was. So. Yeah. Alright. So be it. Hope you're doing well, Maha. Exactly, you must follow it. Past a certain point. You could visualize a part, uh, the paths of air parcels and how they change with height if you use high split. So sometimes they do go back over the Rocky Mountains middle. Damn, what a good lab, and Floatzel's the worst one. Jesus. Dude. Bolt Absorb, Stab, Bubble Beam. But it's a man's. That hurts. That sucks. Oh, we just have to hit Zap Cannon. I mean, even if it swapped the attack and speed, it has no HP and low special defense. It's not gonna live anything. It's an interesting mod, though. It's another great lab, though. Man, labs are amazing today. That's not that much XP for Gyarados? Why doesn't that give more?
I need mean look for scouting. I'm not running this mod. <laughs> I need to have a move that doesn't just automatically kill whatever I'm looking at. Most likely to sm start small talk at the urinal in an airport bathroom. Cool. Thank you for the 200 bits, Ivan. <laughs> that will be our next lab redemption. Could have been good. Not quite, though. Mr. Mime is a strict downgrade, but... Oh, I outspeed it. Yeah, I don't think so. Not really. Its special defense is pretty low with uh, the, ba the minimum base HP. So it would still die in like one hit, even if you swap those those uh, stats. Oh my god, one out of a hundred. I'm dead! Bro! One out of a hundred to miss two fucking roar times in a row and then I get stab pedal danced. Oh my god, kill me with that. Lame body? That's disgusting. Mirror coat? is disgusting. Uh, the hippo? Oh, come on! No, man, this was the one. We only had leaf tornado. Just kidding. <laughs> we get, yeah, we only had leaf tornado until move free learner and confusion eruption. Yeah, that doesn't do it. That was the best mondo by far. Blah. How how is that possible when you roll a one out of a hundred chance? Yeah, that was a good hippo. No moves. So add the spread. No moves. Yeah, that's part of that's still his PV too, Isabella. That was with the cradle. We, I I remember that. We're doing well, Gabalek. Aftermath, yeah! Aftermath is the only ability I've won Kaizo Iron Man with, so clearly it must be a good ability. That was the game winner right there. Tough evening? We're 2 hours 47 minutes in. Man, it could get worse. Alright, small talk at the urinal in an airport bathroom. Well, it's definitely... I don't know, he's shy, right? He's shy. There we go. I mean, those big- those big-ass hips, right? <laughs> not only is he gonna be doing- not, not only is he gonna have some small talk, he's actually- his hips are actually just going to be in the way of your urinal. <laughs> just gonna butt you out of the way. Time to fight Ho-Ro. Can either Buddy Wire or Hustle Heart Stamp. Whoa, I outspeed. I didn't expect that. Alright, well. Come on, you cannot do that, you know? This thing's actually really scary. Yeah, I'm dead. 100%. This has like 200 base special attack. Easy, easy. Yep, 181. Could have had imposter. <laughs> yep, Hariyama's 474, Makuhita's 237. So it doubles. It's a double weight BST Evo. Yep, we saw its attack, its speed, and its special defense there. So I was pretty confident that I had 200 in the other two stats, and I was right. Pretty much. It's 
mine up today? Nice. Are you talking about all in Pokemon Go? Well, I have a shiny Banette in Pokemon Sleep now. <laughs> I have six shinies in Sleep. Augers, dude. Oh, mainland. The airport bathroom mod did not get very far. Middle. Yeah, there's people with like 15 shinies in sleep. Okay. Fighting Gardevoir. Oh, shit. Glaciate's pretty annoying. It's it's Leaf Tornado, but 5% more accuracy. Or not Leaf Tornado, sorry. It low always lowers speed. So it's like Mud Shot, but more power. That's what I meant to say. An Ice type. Not Leaf Tornado. I don't know where that came from. Okay, no poison. You should throw now. We may outspeed as well. Fuck. Ah. Uh, God, we lose. <laughs> that sucks. It's best throw move as a quad resistant, and it's still doing damage to me. Oh, wait, maybe not. Wait, we might not lose. Far cry, though. Jesus. I don't know why it keeps horn leeching. I think it has, um... Oh, it has Cursed Body, so that doesn't make sense. I don't know why that's equal priority for throwing. It's really annoying. Acid Spray. Lava Plume. Pretty crappy Crustle. That Gardevoir was not really runnable. V create? <laughs> Add V create? Bro. <laughs> Shit. Uh, yeah, why does it think Horn Leech is. Could have just V created and killed me in one, anyways. <sighs> oh, no. Dude, Shiny Litwick is awesome. Sorry to use Memento, but you found another one. I fucking love Shiny Litwick the entire line. That that's what makes the Litwick line even better is their shinies are really, really good too. Like super good. Top tier. Already being sick Pokemon, their shinies are even fucking better. All of them. Like goddamn. Am I upset at the Scyther? I mean, it had no defense. I wasn't attached to it yet. It had decent moves. I mean it could have gotten really far if I had a easy seed, but so no, not really. It wasn't balanced defensively. All right, most hellish. Thank you, Ivan, for 200 more bits. I appreciate it. Jover, Celio, probably Loudred. Loudred easily fits the bill here. It's the most cursed one. Most cursed of the three. Stab frustration will hit pretty hard.
Memento in prison is pretty funny to scout with, yeah. Maybe eventually a tone. Yeah, I haven't found one. Never saw it. Eggable male chat. <laughs> Good name. Eggable male chat. Rock a rock. And the mints, of course. By trade, you do it for money. What's up, Millie Moon? Oh, I forgot to update the shiny command. So we did we did see our first black two shiny. On a blues day, it was a toga tick. <laughs> died. <laughs> I think it died in Alder's house, didn't it? Or was it to a. It was to a trainer on a. On the farm. What the fuck's the farm called? Bro, how can I not remember the farm? Why? I literally go to it all the time. It's just gone. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. Fuck it. Stupid ass farm. Cock Ranch. There we go. It's Cock Ranch. That's how I'll remember it. <laughs> just remember Cock Ranch. Yeah, where did where did that go, man? That just went out of my brain. Oh yeah. All right. 18 at nine is pretty perfect here. I like scouting with 18 speed. If something doesn't have 18 speed at eight, it's too slow in this game, pretty much. Pretty much always. So it's a good thing to scout with, since most things on Cock Ranch here are level eight. Rainy cast form. Soaking. Oh, that boosts my special attack. Don't kill it. Oh my god. Ugh. That was so close to being stupid. Did I get a status heal? That was so close to being dumb. Water spout. <laughs> Kill it. Yeah, Loudra just went for it. Fuck. Deep sea skill. That did nine and then eight. And it's fast. Jinx is good. Probably 22 attack, maybe 24. I'm spiderweb, so I can't get out of here anyways. Did I pivot to this, or do I keep scouting? Because this Jinx is not bad. 
It's like the worst type in the game. Like the worst type in the game. Fucking uh, six weaknesses, low BST. One one move as facade, and that's it. Uh, it's really annoying because it's gonna it's gonna outspeed spider web me every time I try to look at other stuff here. So it's it's a really annoying pivot. Why not? It honestly looks promising. Let's see what it has. 22. Uh, dry skin is not good on it. Two special attacks and the rest of its base stat is kind of wasted with low HP. I'm getting better at scouting the attack when it's level 8 or higher. I'm getting a little better at that. For sure. Jinx really have dry skin vanilla? That's such a stupid ability. What? Why is that vanilla? Alright, with flock with flock ranch out to something really annoying, this is probably gonna be dead, but we'll look. Growing. Broging. Sunny cast form, alright. Mm, attack isn't too bad. Honestly, that attack is not too bad. That's not too bad. Could be remotely viable. Plus as technician. Thoughts on cast form? It's a weather Pokemon. I like its forms. I like its forms. Thematically, it's pleasing, so... It's okay. It learns a lot of its moves early, too, for Kaizo, which is kind of interesting. Galvantula. With a drought. I have dry skin, so I'm gonna get hit. That was a crit. Wish Nightmare. Why'd you wait to do that? No attack. Wow. No attack with Stab Fusion Bolt. That sucks. That's a that's a sad loss on Galvantula's behalf. So it did 7 with 150 power Fusion Bolt against 21 defense. It's about 10 attack at 6. It could actually be a decent special attacker, but it has no moves. So I'm probably gonna not go for it. Just analyzing that Galvantula. Wish it was good, but yeah, no. Not looking promising at all. Alright, let's take a look at the Broge. High special defense. Zero attack. If that wasn't a crit, I would have... I would have... Orgasmed. <laughs> that being a crit... Makes it semi-viable at best. Semi-viable at best. I'm not against it, but the fact that cast form is there... I'm not set on Slowbro. When the cast form actually could be decent. <laughs> Even though Slowbro has 75 more BST. I want to know its other moves before I settle on it. I also want to know its defense. This doesn't kill. Okay, that was a crit. That's a shit move, though. That one... Was that a crit, too? 2-6. Two, oh, still 5. Ah, uh, that's... 
just not good. Just not good. Damn it. No fucking moves! It only has mud shots? Oh, ow. I don't think so with only mud shot. What the hell is that, dude? Gummy cola bottles. Those are really good. I would go for gummy worms. Sour gummy worms, please. I'm not sure what to do right now. Still the last thing to see on this row. It's a 5%. Scout cast form more is what I want to do. Yeah, that's a uh, technician. Damn. All right, not viable. Cast form is out. Slowbro is going to be the thing I get if the the last thing here is bad. So we'll go for the five percenter. I mean, there is Galvantula, but like, I I I doubt it. Drought plus no attack could be a special attacker, but no moves either. Probably not. It's an unfortunate early pivot on Jinx, but this is going to be really annoying to get out of outspeed spiderweb. I hate when that happens. Alright, we're stuck in pivot hell. What are you guys up to? What are you doing right now? How's it going? I need something to get me through this mess. If I don't see it in like 20 or 30 Pokemon, I'll probably just go slow, bro. Oh, damn. Charge Stone not being nice to you. Yeah, these arts... These art mass producers are getting really annoying. Because they're not even really scammers anymore. Well, I guess they are, technically, but... The way they contact you on Discord... It's just, it's just not great. Unsolicited. You're going trick-or-treating right now. Yeah, that's not gonna go very well. Spider-Man 2. <laughs> the pizza! Isn't that- isn't the pizza scene from that? Might be wrong. That's all I know about that. <laughs> pizza. National Hockey League Online. Ah, the pizza. Where is it? Give me the thing! It's probably gonna be a... Centret. It's gonna be a Pidove. Painful grind? Why? Pizza delivery mission? Yeah, if that's the one that's memed most often, then yes, that one. There are some people who are fourth monitor content. There it is. And first monitor content. It's not a bad mod, it just needs moves because it learns none. Just not gonna be runnable. I wish this was runnable, but yeah, it's not. I like it more than Slowbro. 
maybe. It might have a better chance to get through. Get through Charon. We'll see what Slowbro had, but I, I'm not too pleased with either one of these, so... We'll have to deal with it. Oh, come on! No speed, though. <laughs> Actually was kind of viable. Dang. No speed. You got Ouroboros. Happy the, I assume, the pork chop turned out well. Imagine Petal Dance Sludge Psychic being on your stone Ramon with no moves. No level up moves. Kind of a sick pull, honestly. Three out of four. Pretty decent moves. Fine gummy. Hawk Climb. Uh, plus one special attack? What the ass? We, not, we might not make it through Charon with this mon either. The fact that it did four damage with 18 special attack with Psychic is kind of weird. But I think, I, I think I've got it down. Ground pork with onion, sauteed, and ginger. Nice. Wine and soy, Vietnamese rice, vermicelli. Nice. Hen pork dumplings. Good lord. That was not what I expected. Speed tie with Darman and Tan. Now you're hungry? Yeah, I'm gonna have some chicken Alfredo after this stream. Chicken Alfredo. It's gonna be sick. I do like steam dumplings, probably the most on average, probably the most. Black Kyurem. We got some fucking amazing pizza today, honestly, I really like it. The one I got was, um, it's called Chicago Heat. What the fuck? Oops, not a special attack. Crushed red pepper in it, but like, it, it was amazing. It was really good. And the place we got it from has a hot honey pizza too. Hot honey with pepperoni. And given the quality was really good, their deep dish also was actually really good for being a chain. It's not Giordano's, by the way. Uh, we are excited to try more. I want to try that hot honey pizza. Yeah, 
Yeah, they... There's some specific chili they put in Kung Pao. I, whenever I get Kung Pao beef... Oh, shit. What the hell? It reminds me of Thai chilies. Never have I, never have I ever eaten it, though. Welcome, Med did once again. Hello, Gwerf. Hope you're both doing well. Mm, wish pedal dance. Hopefully, the second mon doesn't resist it. Oh. Well, it won't. <laughs> that helps. Oh my god, the outspeed. Fucking classic. Chatting. I don't know, maybe this can make it through Charon. If he doesn't have three fucking legendaries again, now we have an Ultra Ball to pivot with, so... Maybe a Verbank comp complex pivot this time would be pretty cool. This is gonna outspeed me. Died the furthest, exclamation point PB. Alder's house once again, followed by Charon once again. Hopefully this has more of a chance than the Slowbro did. I'm worried about what the Slowbro would have learned. Because I think it had similar special attack to this, which is not runnable, but it's not far from being runnable. Going to churn. Will I beat Charon? Gamble open now for a one minute period. Third time today, two doubts. Two times doubters have won. We are 0 for 2. We go 0 for 3, Charonge. Good luck in the bread. Was that speed like base 35, 40 ish? The goal of this mod is to get it out of Charon so that we can Burbank complex pivot. Because we pivoted on Route 20, so we can't access the, the dark grass over there. Forty sixty. Thirty five sixty five. One third believe, two thirds doubt. Okay. Pretty spread. I like the spread. The last two have actually looked pretty similar. The first one was 50 50 with the Rotom, but we had three fucking legendaries on Charon, of course. Not be out speeding that belly drum. <laughs> you need to put the car in the garage yet? No, I don't think so. Evolution, big dick. 
Unless you're trying not to get it dirty in rain, perhaps? Is that what you're asking? So, we can take a look. Yeah, just gonna be cold. Ch next real chance for rain is Tuesday, so... Nothing real conducive. Ah, that's fucking troll. Okay. Two months? Monsoon season, though. It's still neutral. Hopefully we get a three-turner here, right, one shot. After shit. Because, of course, Petal Dance is a special move that makes contact and I get Aftermath. I've barely ever even seen that ability in this game, and it happens when I use a special attack, which is hilarious. Nemesis. Oh, come on, why did you use Slash first, you fucking idiot? Now I'm dead, because of the Goron Berry might save me. God, that's so stupid. Why did he use Slash? Jeez. Coverage comes out second anyways. I hope he has no other Grass or Electric. I need to heal here. Jeez. The ace. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Damn it. No special attack, please. Damn. Just enough to fucking kill me. Okay. Highly unlikely I one-shot. But if we can get him in heal range, we've got him. Nice. Two shot dead. Not two shot. I need this to be a two turner. Return pedal dance and I might die. I might be dead anyways, though. Okay. Togepi, tell me we get through this. Oh my god, no! Why did he get the attack boost? Holy fuck, are you kidding me? Okay. Good, holy shit, I was about to... This is bad. Download, really? Okay, no moves. Out. Wow. Cool.
Holy shit, we made it through that. Machamp and Pooley on Simi Sage. Ace had coverage on me. Energy ball. <laughs> wow, it's better than Mega Drain. Blue Flare unteachable. Able. Ace threw. The ace did throw. It was a range I might have been able to live. Another discharge. My my mistake was healing on semi sage because it used slash instead of bolt strike. I guess the I guess smart AI on chair and sod is a risky move because of the accuracy and once it was below half health, it just decided to send it. I don't know why the fuck it would do that. I would use slash first. It's a route 20 pivot. Thank you for the sip, Ivan. One drop left. Yes, I'm gonna pivot in Burbank. This is a terrible Pokemon. Yep. Any Californian native, so we'll get it every time. Burbank Complex, 16 Pokemon total, 5 outside, 11 inside, 2 pivots, since we can do outside and inside the complex. That's what we're working with. No Route 20 grass, dark grass here because we already pivoted on this route. So we will be working with 27 speed against that. It's going to be incredibly dif difficult, unfortunately. Most everything that's good will outspeed me. It's going to be tough to tell if it's actually runnable or not, too, with this speed. As it typically might be too low. It's wild to me if I've only been here 19 times now. Feels like a lot more than that. Okay. Firestone would be pretty cool if I could use it. One out of 16. No speed, that's good. 
2 out of 16. Hopefully no outspeed on this either. Good. Stunfisk. Okay. No special attack. It's honestly kind of bad. Uh... Oh, what the fuck? Uh... Okay... Weird. So we would not sketch a setup move, we already have one. We could sketch either Stab Ground or Electric. That's interesting, because those both have some really good sketch moves. If it's a physical attacker... Or even mid-physical attack, we could sketch either Earthquake... Or Fusion Bolt, even though that's 5 PP. Probably EQ is what I would go for. Alright, Stunfisk is admittedly interesting. It's also faster. If the other two Pokemon here are trash, I could use it to have a better time in, inside the complex. Although I am more, way more tanky with this, so probably not. <laughs> probably should check in there with Simipore first. Good test is if it's faster at 15, which it probably will be. No, no. It's not, then we know it's exact speed. Yeah, it is. I'm worried about it being too fast, but it is a pretty interesting specimen. Okay, it has heat crash. I mean, it's in the rain, and I resist it. That's like a 10 power move, but it is doubled. It should have done 2 damage. I'm worried about that. I'm really worried about that. Literally 10 damage, but it did 1 instead of 2. Ugh, and I know it's not got special attack. There's just no way. Hmm, it might just have nothing. Might have physical defense and speed, or too much HP. Might be unfortunate. Shell Smash, though. Heat Crash isn't a good... Isn't a great start for a Stunfisk. It's not a really heavy Pokemon. So I'm going probably not on the Stunfisk right now, even with Shell Smash. Probably not. Just need to see one more here, and then we can do Shaking Grass. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if Sunfisk's learn said I wasn't looking. I don't think it's insignificant, though. I can also teach it Energy Ball, but... That's not really useful. Thirteen. Worried. Quad, basically quad resisted, but I'm worried. Alright, Berloom is my other choice. Not liking any of those, so let's see what the Shaking Grass is. Berloom's at least faster. Attack is not horrid, but not good. Yeah, we added Plague Walk. A few people really like that emote, so I, I added it for them. I mean, that's kind of what 7TV emotes are for. A few people like them, they use them. There's hundreds of them.
Oops. Oh, shit. What in the mother fuck? I didn't want that to happen. God damn it, now the shaking grass shows up. Okay, well that attack stat is not terrible. I am very tanky in a crit. Did two thirds to me. 240 power move though. It's probably got about 40 attack at 15, so it might be short of runnable, but we shall see. Is Rock Tomb really in its vanilla moves? Okay, well. Currently, it's looking like a good choice. Cranidos evolves at 30. It's not really accessible. Oh, Technician. Wow. Turns to move at 17, so yeah, we'd have to get it at 15. Why am I outspeeding? Oh, Lord. Have mercy. Jesus. That's not runnable. Fuck, man. Zero special defense. The speed is just average. It was barely outspeeding me. Damn, that sucks. That's pretty bad. Drat. That's unfortunate. Doesn't look like anything's really useful out there. Okay. 11 inside. Here's Little Again, the first one, which is a stone Evo. Average attack, average speed. Oh, great. Just what I wanted to see. No, I did not want to run into him. Oh my god. <laughs> That's okay. It's a lot of XP gone, but whatever. It'll help me pivot better. Sweet and slower and dog shit. What? That poor dog, dude. Just trying to run back to heal. I accidentally sped up through that. Not too much of a problem. That sweet coon was trash. Yeah, we could go Stun Fisk and EQ. That's looking the most likely. Although I don't think its attack stat is any good. And without EQ, I might be in trouble. And its special defense scares me. So currently, I'm not set on anything out there. This will make pivoting easier. Liberal, little Gant. Five things in this light, in this light grass, plus the shaking mon. So six things total here. Oh yeah, Hydreigon as well. So two more, and then, and then the shaking. Everything outspeeds me, so this is annoying. Magneton. Uh, it's really, really hard to make this work, but let's see. It's slow already. Slow already, eh? I think not. Well. 
That changes things. That changes things. Okay. Let's see what moves it has. Looking good. Gross. Pretty gross. Yeah, where's the Firestone pivot room? Well, we still have seven more Pokemon to look at in there, so... There's also one item over there in the, past the dark grass, so I can get that item too. Nothing needs an item so far, but... Okay, one more in the light grass. I found it. Rotom Heat. The only one that has a quad weakness, annoyingly enough. Annoyingly enough. It is faster. Uh, it has zero special defense. Probably a huge attacker. No? Does that do a lot? No, what the fuck? Everything is just so trash. Alright, well, that's trash. We'll be looking at the shaking grass now. Thirty-four to Evo, not doable. All right, onto the dark grass. Hopefully. Bruh, please. Artillery. Out speeds. Special defense is pretty trash. Pack wrecker. Whoa. No attack. I need to get away. Fuck. Okay. This thing's back! Dude, it's so fast, it's gonna fuck me over. I mean, I could get a Jinx that has the right nature, maybe. Row. Jeez, these Pokemon, sh these Pokemon are trash. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. There we go. Fuck yeah, it's literally a glass cannon and a half, and now I can't leave. I'm dead. Literally a glass cannon. I'm gonna die, dude. I can't leave now. Shit. <laughs> yeah, that throw is zero, zero special defense. It's all special attack and hopefully some speed, but that's a scary mon. Just get as much as I can back with Oron Berries here. And there's one Pokemon left that isn't that throw. I might just get the Cocktillery instead, it's at least a little better. Oh my god, no! Keep running into this, I'm just gonna have to take it. The Stunfisk is out there, so... Okay. Okay. <laughs> 
mean, Ralts Evo run. It's just so bad. What do you mean I can't get away from Ralts? Oh my. Don't do this. Bro, come on. Don't do this. Oh. I'm dying. Why did the throw have to... Tr my... Damn it. I'm gonna get the Octillery, I think. Or whatever the last one is. I, I need it. I mean, if I get this, like, I could... Nah, it's just not worth it, man. It's just not worth it. It has nothing. It has nothing. Oh my god. 5% chance to live there. Nice. It might just not have any speed. It might just barely outspeed me. Uh, please stop showing up. Okay. Dude, no. <laughs> I'll take this. Oh, why did I use a Pokeball? I should use Ultra here. It just needs two special attacking moves. It could use Energy Ball. It just needs one... Give me, like, Bubble Beam or something. Bro, come on. No. Alright, it has one move left. This is getting ridiculous. Ugh! It's a spank. Instead of being a special attacker, it was a spank. Stunfisk it is, and then we're probably dead. Dang it, dude. This this seed just had nothing. Spank is all defense and speed. Speedy tank, spank. Chen Chao's 27. Could just evolve into Stunfisk. <laughs> Burbank had nothing except a Hydreigon, which I can't take. Illegal. All right. Stuncock. Not faster, thankfully. Doable. This is runnable. We just need to sketch Earthquake. Low HP. It's the best I can do, though. Fight the double first. Brutal, brutal run so far. <laughs> brutal run.
Yeah, the naughty nature here is very useful. It's actually pretty much the best one besides modest. Jesus, man. Okay, then. Oh, yeah, adamant, not modest. Well, they didn't want anything to do with me. Fuck you. Oh, we missed on an acrobatics, dude. No acrobatics? Shit. Damn, we didn't get shit else besides full tackle. Acrobatics Earthquake. I don't know. No, well, Lee Key Wilson on a gym leader. Oh, Kratidos had it! We could have found this! This was the thing! It had it, man. We could have got this from Kratidos. It was just in the shaking grass. Dang. I didn't think to go for it, honestly. I mean, it would have been a far cry in fucking hell. It would have taken me an hour to search all those moves. I think to search Kranidos. Not that I could have hit... I couldn't have hit Volibee anyways. I would have done that for an hour, then can't hit Volibee, and it just Aqua Tails me twice, and I die. So, like, what do you do, right? What do you do? Yeah, I don't think that was quite doable. So I'm glad I didn't spend that hour, because really? Fuck. We could have won. That was an interesting shell smash mon though. I'm glad it looked the part. I was hoping it would be. I want a I want a better one. Thank you, Hylian, for the five months. Tree to tree. Mass attack, thank you. Nice banger. Yep, semi poor gets it. Thank you, Hylian. Five months, super cool. How's it going? I always just say modest. <laughs> An accident. Middle. Sharking. Good pick. I have no moves for sheer force. <laughs> Honestly, this isn't too bad. I prefer to not have the attack and put that into defenses, but this isn't actually that bad. Yeah, we have not seen Castilia in a while. I miss it. I honestly miss the song. I need some sheer force moves. I need some fucking moves for it. Huge power. <laughs> uh, rock climb is okay. It's not what I want though. Synchro noise is trash. Nah, didn't get shit. Not good enough. Storm throw is the only decent move there.
Aqua Jet would not do enough damage. Just look at how much Vital Throw was doing. That was 140 to Aqua Jet 60. Luster Purge is okay. Oh yeah, that's good for Sheer Force. The problem is, Luster Purge, honestly, you would want not Sheer Force with that because of the 50% chance to drop it. Although it'd do the same damage over two turns. So you know what? No, actually, that's fine. It'd do the same damage over two turns if you got the drop versus just Sheer Force. Or no, no, it would do more with the... What is... I think it's roughly equal. No, Storm Throw is not affected by Sheer Force. Storm Throw is at, like, level 30-something. Oh my god, my head. Middle. Chatting! Keep up, chat! Oh, that was almost right. It's in the fire type slot, though. <laughs> Shield the dust. Cool, let's do an Evo run. Uh. Hey look, 9 defense and 8 special defense again. And 13 speed and 13 attack. Literally 4 of these... 4 of these uh, stats were the exact same on the Sharpedo. That's actually wicked. What are the odds of that? <laughs> I feel like I just won the lottery. Furries! Yeah, that would be kind of wild. One more of those. Oh, I should use. No, Twister sucks. Actually, didn't need the crit there. That was a high roll, I think. Random chatter chat. <laughs> Chatting. Good rival name. How's it going, Boo Head? Well, uh... I think we just, uh, you know, uh, skip a few stages, 99-100. That's not great. Early canes, let's go. Uh, Samurad is no good, but Charge Beam, like, I need it to have runnable special attack before Charge Beam, not after. Of course, James. Yeah, it's not really that uncommon. Like, the records are uncommon, right? That's a record. To beat a record is uncommon, but the sequence is not actually as rare as you think. <sighs> Fuck. I want this to have runnable special attack, but it doesn't, and it has low defense and mid special attack. That means even if it is a physical attacker, it's just not gonna do it.
Either it has low defense or it has low HP. If it has low HP... Wow, it's epic. <laughs> it's the starter run. If it has low HP, maybe it's a little more runnable than I think it is. So, like, I'll look at it, but... I'm not expecting... I'm not expecting too much. Alright. No reason to not get this at 6. It's more likely to show up at 6. It always bugs me when I get the 5. That's a 10%. The 6 is 20. Maximum special attack here is 16. I'm expecting 14. Hmm, yeah, 16, probably. I'd be surprised if it were higher than that. Maybe... Maybe maximum is 18? I doubt it, though. Sam. Yeah, well, that's what I thought it would have. Just a mixed attacker with low defenses, but high HP. I wish I could like it, but... Just, I, I don't. I don't like it. I would run it with Thrash, Night Slash if it's defense and special attack were swapped. With the low special defense, I'd be willing to do it still. With both of them low, nah. Soft boiled certainly does not help. Alright, well, let's take a look at the IV. If the IVs are super good, then maybe I'll reconsider, but I'm doubtful. I don't think it's bad IVs, that's for sure. Yeah, it's just above average. not enough for me to consider it. I mean, if it learns Razor Shell... Yeah, I just want that defense to be a little higher. Oh, time to scout options. If options suck, then we'll be fine. Oh wait, no, I still have to fight her, don't I? Yeah. I was actually hoping to go in with 20 speed. It's a really good number to scout Cock Ranch with. Oh wait, we might do that anyways. This Zubat's not gonna level me up. Okay. Shiny stone. Hockey helmet. Right, dude, the items are really good. Lemonade Old Ghetto. That's pretty sick. Well, I'll fucking be! Jesus. My third ever full restore in this game. Wow. Maybe I will run the Samurott then. I need something good for those items. Trebuchet is the common. A 
That's pretty wild. Uh, yeah, I need something good. Another starter? See if Venus Grass has anything. Oh, come on. I get away from this. You gotta be shitting me, man. Chimchar out speeds. What's up, Breezy Pop and Lezik? Hope you're both doing well. And Snow Golem. You've been here a little bit, but... I mean, sure, Cold was okay. I didn't keep it because, uh... I don't know. I should have put it over Twister, but it doesn't really matter. Because I wasn't going to run the Oshawott. I was not running the Oshawott, even though I ended up doing that anyways. Here's the Oshawott anyways. Just skipped a couple steps. I'm usually along the shaft, James. Hope you're doing well, D-Goon. I'm just answering his question. I'll go to the balls, maybe. The balls might have it. Ignoring the balls? No! God, you think I'm just common trash, don't you? You think I'm just common trash? Fucking horrible. How dare you assume that about me? I am M. Tyler. It's no not no or it's no non-stop nut November after all. Leffa? Uh-oh, this is not a good grass. Non-stop nut November, yeah. Nodders for sure. Two five percents left, I believe. More than likely, I didn't find the 5%. What's up, Scott? You have to catch up? I wish you luck, my friend. Yes, you should bust a nut. I encourage everybody in chat that can bust a nut to bust a nut. It's healthy for you. You ever watch The Wolf of Wall Street? Is not no shave November. I agree with that. The streamer orders it. I mean, you can do what you want, but you don't have to do it right now. Very good dark eclipse. They charge interest on missed days. Give me one of the rares, please. I'm done after six out of seven. Only Chimchar outspeed, so this isn't really annoying, but. Speak of the devil. Oh. Chill, you fucking demon. Destroy Dick December. Interesting. Well, maybe you might- I mean, you might have to do that because there's sub -sember coming up on Twitch. September? Now it's sub -sember, man. They're gonna do that- they're gonna do another thingy. That's like September, but for... Krimbus. For Krimbus. For Mary Chrysler, man. But though- I, I saw that they're gonna have the bits discount as well. That- the bits discount, whenever they do that, as long as it's enough, that's like the most viable one-to-one -one thing that they offer. Cause you can you can eclipse PayPal fees if it's if it's nearly one-to-one, -one, and it has been one-to-one -one before. So it's a good thing it's a good thing to look out for if you want the actual most direct donation possible. Besides uh, tax, I guess. There's always tax. Dude, can I find a 10% chance, please? 
One out of ten. This is ridiculous. I don't know why these Pokemon won't show up. One out of ten, and these two alone have constituted nearly twenty. Now they've constituted twenty. Why can't this work like this? Goodness, come on. AGDQ is sitting at, um, what is it, 1,040 odd people who have registered out of 2,400 as the cap. So they're below 50% for in person attendance. I don't mind that. 1,000 people is still a very large amount at a single hotel. It's pretty cool. But if you're interested in going, yeah, there's still a lot of room. The odds loop. This is fucked. It's ridiculous. What's up, Etchy? Well, yeah, that's part of it. All the Lara. We've. There's nothing to say. There's nothing to say on the matter. It's already been discussed to death and back. Everybody knows why and has their own assumptions about it. I'm just stating where it's at. There's no use talking about it. Ditto, thank you. That's the 11, too, unless I got the 1%. Uh, there's one more Mon there. It's probably the best Giga Chad and Bully on ever, but I don't feel like going for it. So we'll look at this. We have boners and one other thing. Exactly. A lot of people who don't like them, you don't want them anyways. This is 31 to Evo. That's not as bad as I thought it was. Would be pretty hard to do, though. Okay. Flareon. Okay, let's see what Flareon has. Does Trump Card really not miss? Wow. I didn't know that. It was definitely 100 AC. That, that's definitely a Gen 5 change. What, Drillbur? Uh, no, I wouldn't say so. Sandstorm Marowak. It's intriguing, I must admit. Uh, Drober's... I mean, Drober would be okay. It would go into a lot of the strong ground types, but it's not any... It's not anything super special. And at 31, yeah, good luck. You have to get through Roxy to do that. We got really lucky on Roxy on the Fracture run to get through, and really, really lucky on Berg. I want to see Flurry on here. Okay, let's see what we got. Fast as fuck. God, it's so bad. Damn it. Basically need the quiet nature on this. And even then it's probably not worth running. It just dies instantly to a special attack. I had to leaf tornado there. I didn't expect it to kill me, so I didn't heal. I, 
think it has, um... I think it could have 20 special attack at 6. But it also has over 20 speed, which is... Not good. Its special defense is either mid with 0 HP, or it's just terrible. Like, probably around 8 special defense. <laughs> I need it to have 10, at least. 11, 12 preferable. But it does not have that. And I found the rare! Cool. Um, here's the thing. It might be slightly more viable than Samura. Maybe. Not super convinced, though. I just, I just need to know its moves. I just have to know its moves to know if it's better or not. Like, that's all I... I have nothing else I can do. If I can learn its moves, we'll be in the know. But until then, yeah, I have no sh no freaking clue. I do have a full restore and an early eliminate in this run, so it is pretty important that I get this right for the right on. And this Samurott really isn't terrible, but... It has some defenses to make up for the speed, at least. Uh, okay, well, we can't take Drizzle. <laughs> That's pretty horrible. Uh, yeah, I don't think I want that. <laughs> Great, that's its other ability. That's gonna make this even worse. Gonna make this even more annoying. Oh, hell. Probably has Weather Ball. Jesus Christ, that's terrible. Hey, its attack is not high, so... This one has a better special defense. Whoa, game, please. What the fuck? Oh, shit. Jesus, that's so bad. Uh. No, oh, it didn't do enough. Did I outspeed this one? Did I outspeed it? What happened? Did I outspeed this one? Hurricane Drizzle. Wait, does that? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Well, I mean... That yeah, was not outspeeding it. That's its fourth move. Outspeed debond. <laughs> what a fucking menace. I don't think it's gonna be good, but it does have the silly. It does have the silly, but it's not gonna be any good. Uh... Yeah, there's just nothing I can do to make this runnable. I'm, I'll try Hurricane Drizzle. I'll try it. You can catch and release Aldalar. I've done it. I did it last run, actually. If you're before the lab fight in Heart Gold, you just kill it. Yeah, if you just get XP. Alright, so we have to find a Drizzle Flareon at level 6 or 5.
If you run out of balls, you can KO it and then skip a trainer to save the XP. Or to mitigate the XP. Oh, this is a grind. Come on. Drizzle Flareon with Hurricane. I was thinking about Thunder. I was like wondering if that if it would have Thunder. And then yeah, Hurricane is perfect attack in the rain. Shit. The problem is it's so fast, it's always gonna go first with the weather. <laughs> if something else has weather, it's over. The Leaf Tornado, perfect accuracy hurricane. Alright, Drizzle right here. Come on. Yep, there it is. As an evil Flareon with that that fast and debond. Comes the minus special attack nature. Yo, that only did one that time. Maybe minus attack. Come on, come on. Give me a good Flareon right here. Give me the top tier Flareon. Fuck off. Nice crit. Here we go. Need a plus nature on special attack if that's at all possible. Bearable run, barely runnable is what I agree with. Basically, exactly what we thought. Ugh. These spreads make me so mad. Yep, Destiny Bond on this base 160 speed Clarion. <laughs> well, with Hurricane, it might be good enough to get through Charon. It might actually get through Charon. Forget it quickly? Not quickly enough. It's gonna take till 21. That's pretty fast, though. In Black 2, that's pretty fast, actually. Power Trick Glass Cannon. <laughs> Argman. So close. We have the silly. This is the silly Drizzle Hurricane. That is a Gen 5 silly. But it's not on a really good mon. Quiver Dance, though. <laughs> Quiver Dance, though. I wonder if I outspeed the mod. Also, I named it FL, Florida, Hurricane. <laughs> that's fine. Oh, that's decent attack. Yo, what the fuck? I guess the moves are good enough. Actually getting Quiver Dance with this would be kind of cool. Glad we picked the Drizzle one. Uh... <laughs> okay. This is not actually a bad mon now, I would say. Just has no special defense. 
dead to imposter again, bro. Dead to imposter. Imposter. The IV's okay. I mean, they're not gonna be anything spectacular, because it's not a spectacular mon, but... Slightly below average. Florida used Leaf Tornado, Florida used Hurricane, and Florida used Muddy Water. It's actually fucking perfect. Man, this is just useless, but whatever. <laughs> actually perfect. <laughs> this is the Florida Mon! This is the Florida Mon, man. I like this guy. This is fucking funny, dude. I don't, this is just a content run at this point. I don't even care. Definitely a content run. Florida Mon. <laughs> Florida Mon wins Black 2 Kaiser. I'll believe it when I fucking see it. Send it though. This is the this is the Florida Mon. Actually send that shit. No, you cock. Damn, that actually hurts a lot. That weather, the weather change hurts a shit ton. Floridian. <laughs> Floridian. Ugh. Bruh, 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 bruh. Nice fucking stab night days, lower my accuracy. Shit. Are you kidding? Don't die to that. It's really annoying. There's no guarantee I kill this. Might be dead here. Okay. It probably still doesn't outspeed me. Oh my lord, what?! Good god! What the fuck? What happened? Oh, multi skill. Thank you. God damn it, Gen 5 moment. <laughs> I'm getting used to it still. Getting used to it still. Forgot about it. Multi scale for a moment. I have to learn the hard way, so that helps me out. If I learned Thunder with this, it would be the ultimate meme. <laughs> Literal Florida Mon through and through. Chatting! Slap. Scissoring.
Lord Amon. This is so, this is gonna be a. I'm gonna remember this run all the time. This is really fucking funny. If it learns thunder, I'll never forget this run. Lord Amon, embodiment. So, dude, the heals, man. We have a full restore, a lemonade, a soda pop, and the what the shit before Charon? I don't think I'm ever gonna beat these heals. Three hundred and seventy percent. Write that down. Good guy. This is ridiculous. You're dead, bro. You're dead, bruh. Uh, bro, not sturdy. Okay. What was that? Rock type? Doesn't matter. That's only like the fourth time I've seen sturdy proc in this game. Wow. <laughs> That's kind of stupid, but whatever. It's shed coverage. We have hurricane shed coverage, too. I read the first Monoclair Parish song. We have I read the first Monoclair used Frustration five times, allowing you to use X items, only to use Parish song next. No, but I have been Parish- I have been mirror coded by the first Monoclair. Yeah, it's Florida. We need orange juice. Wow, even more drizzling. All right, this is gonna be really interesting. This is gonna be really cool. Heavily dependent on whether or not I get weather ability or not on Charon, especially, but will I beat him? We are one for three on Charon today. Here's a pred. What do you guys think? Will we beat Charon with Drizzle Hurricane plus Money Water and Leaf Tornado coverage? It's a pretty cool, uh... It's a really, really cool setup, actually. It just happens to be on a really shoddy Flareon. Hurricane Drizzle just has 100 ack in the rain. That's it. It's pretty simple. Oops. It is the silly, as a result. Same with Thunder. Thunder would be 100 ack always with this mon when it's raining. Keep in mind, we do have more, more heals. I'd like to conserve them, but we do have them. Okay, 19 people in the Pred. 20 people in the Pred. Not bad. 72% believe we're gonna win. That's impressive for a spread like this. You're almost never gonna see that. Oh, it's a bypass? It doesn't even matter if I mac down? Really? Oh yeah, it does it just never miss. Perfect accuracy. I guess that means over 100, yeah. Yeah, I actually didn't know that. Is Thunder the same way? Alright, here we go. Just down. Didn't want to muddy water in case it miss. Lots of storms in there that sound like Gen 9 moves or some wild shit. That's good to know. Bypass accuracy. I don't know if it's that way in Gen 4. Alright, this all muddy water. It's not a threat. Raichu, I have to muddy water. Fucking crap. Worst move in the game for me. But thankfully, I hit first. And Leaf Tornado is not going to kill here, I think. It's gonna be a range, so I am gonna go for Muddy Water again. That's always gonna have Water Spell. And good special defense. So, we need to never see Raichu. We see Raichu again. 
it's not looking good. Yes, that was not great. That was not great. Here we go, Charon time. Jacqueline. Quellen. Miss. Okay. We should tank that just fine. What the S? Oh, that's terrible. Gravity? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. I don't even need rain now. Hurricane just hits, anyways. Muddy water hits though. It's actually useful. AA run. Oh, which one? Normal. Ace is out second. I think I'm doomed here. Miss. Oh my god, again. Come on. Yes? Wow, we lived that shit. In the rain, by the way. I don't know how. Avalanche. Jeez. This has coverage, I'm doomed. And I think it probably does. It's physical. Nice crit. That probably mattered. Spinda with Cloud Nine. Oh, come on! Immediate miss. Yeah, I can't even kill it. God damn. physical at least. Just have to live the last mon. It's the last mon! Hopefully it has no coverage. Relicant? Okay. Slower and shit. Not free at all. Not free at all. We used our soda pop, but I'm down with that. <sighs> Goodness gracious, man. Hydro pop. <laughs> oh my god, man. What are these moves? Florida Mon beats Charon. Charon does not like Florida. I mean, I guess I might as well teach it. Unable? <laughs> what do you mean Florida Mon can't teach it? Samurott can learn it, though. That might have been a throw. You're watching this stream in the weirdest place possible. Good to see you, bird. Uh, enjoy. Uh, well, I want to look at the Verbank Complex pivot, which, speaking of which, I need to deposit. Yeah, Florida. 
I want to look at them because I'm really fast, so I'll be able to look at everything with no problems. Yo, I have no problems looking at it. So, we just scout if everything is interesting on that. There's 16 Pokemon to look at, if they're all at least interesting. I didn't buy repels. A church? A church at 2.40 in the morning? Or are you over in EU? CK Walsh for the 200 bits. Good lord. I'm sorry that happened to you today. What the heck is going on? People's lives are wild and out. We did pivot on this route. So no dark grass here. Well, I'm glad to be on and the reason you're on. I'm glad I'm the reason you you were you were up to not miss out on that on that shaking grass. Why'd that appear there? <laughs> the things you do as a streamer, you just never you just never think of it, man. Like what? You were I was streaming and kept someone up and then their pipes exploded and they were awake to hear it so that they could fix it without losing thousands of dollars of shit. That's actually fucking wild. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, I'm I'm sorry that happened, but I I guess I'm thankful I helped. Hawkinson's. Thank you for the 500 bits, Scott. <laughs> Slash as. No, absolutely don't do that. Imagine I didn't stream tonight. Yeah, I was pretty set on doing it. I was feeling pretty confident. Today was not a real iffy one. Pluming. Well, you get to keep those thousands. You don't get. You don't have to give them to me. I am not your pipes or your insurance company. Although you don't. Whatever. Although I was kind of your insurance company just then, wasn't I? Makeshift insurance. All right, let's look at our options. There are 16 Pokemon. It would be a throw not to look at them, even though Florida Mon is really fucking funny and cool. Just look and see if there's anything, like, the only thing I would pivot off of, or pivot to here, is, like, a favorite, or, you know, Archeops, or something like that, so. Why is that, Scott? Like, I'm not gonna pivot off, I'm not gonna pivot for a Honchkrow, it literally have to be perfect spread, night days, tail glow, Discharge and you know, it just doesn't have that. It doesn't have that. Sure, I worked for 15 and a half hours. I think I'm reading that right, right? Jesus. Yep, I see, I see. <laughs> oh my goodness. Some sometimes you get on and I'm off already. <laughs> Sigilyph. Where are... I'm trying to imagine where you're based. Ooh, Zemstrika. Whoa. V-Create. What the fuck? Uh... 
Uh, so V create is 45 power right now, and it did five damage against 72 defense. I mean, it's not the worst attack I've seen. Oh, why? Right, you've told me that before. Sorry. You know what? There's a ass load of stuff to keep track of. I think you understand. <laughs> but that's right. Yeah, I got you. You know, all you have to do is say it, and then it all comes flooding back, right? Just need reminders as a streamer. I I thank people who are patient with me for that. Are you usually later than 19.30 then? Because that... Your time... That's like the middle of my stream, pretty much. Dead center. Just going for recreate. I'm interested in seeing what this attack stat actually is. Can you use something that's not V-Create? Jesus. Aim, thank you for the raid. How's it going? Frosty, thanks for blazing. Holy smokies, man. Wild AI moment. Jesus. That one did six. I'm interested in catching this as my HM friend, actually. I just want to know what this... Whoa. I want to know what this has. Inferno? <laughs> yeah, let, let's catch this as an HM friend. That's fucking hilarious. This is my friend. And, of course, I can't catch it. He's slim. Dude, that's... That's a fair amount of damage. I want to scout this as having, uh... I want to scout this Zeb Strike as actually having above three times its level. I want to say it's about... I, I want to say it's at least 40, 43 at 15. I just don't know what to think. So HM friend here, not pivoting. Yeah, I did it. I did it. So it's 57. I was right. But it was absolute trash outside of that. Absolute garbage. That's the slide stat spread where it just kind of goes down when each stat. <laughs> it's, it's really funny. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Uh, happy I learned that. We'll keep that as the HM friend for sure. More zero zero attempts. Did I not type 200? Is that three or four Pokemon here? I don't remember. Oh, it's no way. I don't remember the Pokemon. Sig Siglyph? Zebstrika? The other one that I started with, I don't remember the fourth. Haunch. I didn't start with Honchgrow, did I? No, I think I've seen all of them. It is, but they missed the two. <laughs> Alright, let's be careful here. I'm not gonna get this trainer out. Well, I mean, I probably won't pivot off where I am, but... Oop, I accidentally ran into it. Oh no, it's Volcarona again. Volcarona again, dude. Alright, well... Everything seems to have that. Alright, well, it's not gonna have speed. Mm. Yeah, it, it's. Carlos is a wonderful person, eh? Okay, that is low attack. Or mid. It's low to mid. I feel confident scouting that now. I should have actually kept going on that guy, I don't know why I didn't. 
So Volcarona is one of the mods that I was willing to look at. However, it's extraordinarily dependent on moves because it learns every 10 levels. It has to have the move set, or it's not worth it. Gallade arguably is another one, but it's kind of on the lower end. Carbonara, let's go. Okay, get me the fuck out of here. Thank goodness that doesn't lock you in battle, that'd be so annoying. Well, he's back to making content aim, so perhaps... I know a guy who can maybe talk to him sometime. Yeah, David Piano, one of my mods, he knows Carlos. I wouldn't say super closely per David's words, but he knows him. They're both musicians. It would be really sick, huh? I, I freaking love Sunny Shore City, man. Like, Sunny Shore City... Scraffy, scraggy. That's the good shit. Uh, is that five? Scraggy, Tropius, Murkrow. No, I think that's still only three. I'd love to see it. I mean, I don't. I'm not saying I can make it happen for you, but I mean, I am at least one person who would agree. <laughs> Masculine. I think there's one more here. I don't think I saw the fifth. Eleven years, wow. What was the other thing I just saw? Ah, there it is. Okay. Nothing here. So, Volcarona's here. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Kind of scared of this killing me, actually. Oh, contrary! Holy fuck! Oh my god, do I do it? Oh my god, do I do it? Whoa, Jesus Christ, contrary high special attack Charizard. Mm, I don't know any of its moves. I don't know. Lordamon's so cool. And this could have no speed. It could have zero speed. It could just be so fucking bad. It could be a man's. It could be no D, no special D, no HP. Its special defense is at least not zero, because Leaf Tornado did do. I would run away and scout more, but like it's the level 20. It's really hard to get this actually. It's gonna it's only like a 5%. Actually, let me look. Let me look at this real quick. The 20 is hard to get. When does it learn moves? 17, so like I'd have to get the lowest level one, which is kind of a shit. Yeah, the level 20 is a 1% chance. Or a 10% if it's slot number 5, which it might be. So it's probably the 10%. So it's only 10%. I could I could come back. High HP? Why? I don't think you can... Th this was not necessarily one damage. This could have been two. 
but you can't tell the pixels because these first two are kind of different from the rest. I like Flareon a lot. I do. I know it doesn't win though, it's just it's just a meme. Stab Muddy Water, Stab Eric. Like, it's just a meme. Uh, Charon gave Hydro Pump, so that does synergize with the special attack, but it's not a great move. I don't know what else it has. I mean, if it has a water move, or a rock special move, or a ground special move, I die. Because it did 28 with Swift. I mean, we could plug this into the count. 28 with Swift, 60 power move against 22 special defense. It's not like my special defense is any good. Honestly, maybe that's not that great a special attack. Maybe it's only like 50-ish. Maybe it's not as good as I think it is. I mean, it seems good, though, because I do have... No, I think it's still pretty good. Uh... Let me get the... Let me get the... Clarion, Link Set, Charizard, Link Set, 23, 20, Move is Swift. Move a swift against my 22 special defense. What is this Flareon? Base 31 special defense. Oops. Base 31. So Charizard has roughly. Charizard has roughly 120 special attack. To 130 to 140. 120 to 140. That's ru that is runnable. 120 to 140. To do 28 damage with Swift. Against 30 base 31 special defense. That's with 31 IVs too on my special defense. If I have 15 IVs, then it's much lower. Yeah, it's like base 110. Oh yeah, it needs to be, yeah, it's like base 1, it's it's like base 100 to 115. Yeah, because I got my, I got my stat to equal 22 special defense, which is what I have. So, it's expected special attack is 51. I nailed that, actually. I nailed that. It's expected special attack is 51 at 20. That's exactly what I said it would be. So, it's only two and a half times level. It's equal to my special attack. level slower. Two and a half times level. That's not what I usually run, but it has contrary. I can't believe I nailed that special attack. Let's go. Man, we're fucking beast. Given base 105 special attack. Yeah, 
It's got about like 53. If that was a mid roll, it has 55 special attack at, at 20. That's still closer. That's closer to the 3x level. And then it could be um it could be a down nature, honestly. It could have runnable special attack and just this one is terrible. So and I don't know its moves, so we probably leave and scout it more. We probably leave and scout this more because contrary is a big deal. That is a big deal. It's a very big deal, I just said. So that's mod number four here. There's one more, and the shaking grass as well. I think we have to scout this. If that was the low end of that Charizard's range, then... I mean, that thing could be... That thing could be really fucking good. If it learns the right move, it could just be good. But the problem is, if I go back there and it hits me with... Power Gym, I die. That's a one-shot. So... I There are a lot of things I might die to. Here, I'm not very confident. That even Draco Meteor would one shot me. Fuck me. Alright, I mean, it's worth looking at. Contrary Charizard, pretty cool. Run almost runnable special attack, pretty cool. Yeah, it is the 10%. Alright, well, let's, uh. What can I do? Um... <laughs> uh, um... <laughs> well... <laughs> that's certainly a move. Jesus. Okay... So now it's level 17. Now it's level 17, it's raining. It's raining and it's used blue flare. Oh, I have flash fire, hun. What the fuck? Blue flare. In the rain. Blue Flare in the range should do 15 on a level 17 Charizard with base 110 special attack. So yeah, we are right on the money. We're right on the money. This is base 110 across two of them. All right, I'm not. I'm not risking not doing. It. I need to be at full for this. And we are taking this one by one. One by one, we are taking this on, especially now that we know. Blue flare. Imagine it has contrary V create, man. I think I'd shit my pants, even though it's a special attacker. Might be a mixed attacker. I'm worried about it, man. There's so many ways it could go wrong, but it is a contrary Charizard with blue flare, so. And I don't know if it has speed. I can't tell. I have 78 myself. That's too much. Also, I need to use Leaf Tornado on the one I get. That one did 30. Oh, man. Man. Oh, man. Yeah, it can roll 30 with base 110. That's doable. It can roll up to 31, maybe 32. So that's telling me it's got 55 special attack right now. And base 110 does not prevent it from having a lot of other shit. 534 BST. Stab blue flare. Like, we get that, right? We get that. 
I think we just get that. So... Don't kill me. And have Contrary here. Yep, okay. No crit. 32! Alright, give it to me. Don't fucking... Don't fucking miss, come on. I have to get this one. Oh god, alright. Do we pivot? Do we pivot? Oh my god, dude. I love this Flareon. This Flareon's so fucking funny. But do we pivot? I think we have to. We have a contrary blue flare Charizard. Base one, base one ten plus. Honestly, it rolled a thirty-two. That's the rare one. It's probably one fifteen. So about fifty-seven special attack at twenty. Flareon is a meme. Contrary on a good mon. Easy pivot. All right, we'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. Just need speed. 59, that's perfect. That's perfect HP. Perfect HP, good special attack. Give me those stats, man. Give me them. 42! No defense. It's a mixed attacker, no D. Okay. Fucking bot. Get the fuck out of here, man. Oh, uh, no D. The mild nature is not good on this, but... God, man. This is just as much of a meme as Flareon is, I think. If we roll V-Create, though, then it's funny. Is it better than Flareon? Yeah, slightly, because of Blue Flare. But only because of that. I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> I like the Flareon, but yeah. I mean, this feels the same. This feels the same. You're right on the money with the stats, though. That's cool. Gotta do a contrary run? Sure do. And honestly, with the Florida Mon run being in the same thing, this run is super funny. Hopefully we just avoid... Avoid Doom. Above average. Above average, just barely. So not terrible. Alright. <laughs> what, what a scouting thing. That was a hell of an intense scout. I'm down for it though. You give me stab blue flare with contrary, run full special attack, I'm definitely going to take a look at it. Fuck, my HM friend's illegal. I forgot about that, but I'm running out of detriment, so if it kills me, then deserved. Doesn't give me a benefit. This is a bad thing. <laughs> This is a bad thing, not a good thing, so it's fine that I'm using it now, and then we'll get rid of it after this. Just made it twice as hard to kill Curlia. Rip Florida Man. Florida Mon is going away. F. Dude, I even remember- I even remembered that, and then I was like, oh shit, wait, <laughs> got to put it away. It's like, wow, it's not gonna rain in my double battle. Big Apex. Oh, Mold Breaker's illegal, too. We'll go Shield Dust. Alright. 
All right, here we go. Charizard run. Uh, if I get V Create, this run might result in a W. V Create is the run winning move. That is it. That's just it. Since we have physical attack, it gives me plus defense, special defense, and speed. So that's the run winning move. I roll V Create. I'm cheating. I'm cheating. Withdraw. Better than after you, I guess. I am Fimboy. Thank you, Rius. Honestly, a little sad to leave Flareon behind, but... And also, we left Volcarona behind without scouting it. But it's not gonna be good. Contrary makes all stat downs become stat ups. Stat ups become stat downs. Oh wait, why did I take withdraw? Uh, <laughs> why the hell did I do that? <laughs> shit. No, Alright, shut up. Cac W. Omega lol. Oh, Hydro Pump. Yeah, thank you. Oh, fuck off, chat. Jesus. I'm so stupid. Whatever, we have Hydro Pump to teach. Go for alligators, not good. Water coverage. Bait imposters? Yes! <laughs> I don't think imposters would use it, actually. Uh, let me have this. Unable. Unable. Fuck. Meow, 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 meow. Yes, contrary Draco Meteor doubles my special attack. Contrary Overheat doubles it as well while being stabbed. By the way, we have a full restore and a lemonade in this run. And I used a soda pop early. So it's broken. Alright. Good fucking luck to me. Uh, overheat. Oh. Okay, thanks, man. Overheat probably goes over Blue Flare, yeah. But honestly, it'd just be better to have both of them. Although Overheat is always better than Blue Flare. It's just 5 PP. That's the problem with it. So it goes over Withdraw. <laughs> it goes over Withdraw at the moment. Not showing unable? Oh, because 7 TV is broken right now, that's why. Yeah, 7 TV is fucked up at the moment. They're having problems. This is incredible XP. Haha, <laughs> you're a water type move when you outspeed me in the rain. So funny. So funny. Yo. There's no way attack at all. Thirty-three oh eight. That might help out quite a bit. Wow. God, I love Blissey. Fuck yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's non-stop nut November right there. Blissey in this game is cracked. I think the only good natures on this are neutral or minus special defense. So Naughty would have been okay. Rash would have been okay. Uh, Naive would have been okay. Even, uh... Relaxed. No. Lax. I always get them mixed up. Fuck. I think it's lax. Relaxed is minus speed, yeah.
fire punch. I'd like to have that move too. I need a good physical move. I have great physical attack and nothing to use. Uh, yeah, the base attack is definitely higher than the base special attack. No idea where you're going, congrats. <laughs> That'll be me too. Superpower, fuck yeah. Imp superpower, close combat. Superpower is better in this case. Uh, I'd even take hammer arm. Give me tail glow. <laughs> it's gonna be so troll when I get it. Wow, I can't believe we pivoted off Florida Man. Holy shit. Oh, that's horrible. Uh oh. Let's see, blue flare, ninety-seven power did half. Swift should kill here, right? Every time, every time it kills, every time. Yeah, Swift has to kill here. It has to. scary. Whew. Yeah, not great. <laughs> Soul Boy, thank you for the three month resub. I accidentally taught withdraw, but it was over after you, so who gives a shit? It's just a useless move still. Welcome to Eagle Sub Badge Club. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate the reason. Enjoy the emotes ad free viewing another month. How's it going? We've already been hit by Rock Wrecker this run, but on the Flareon, I think. Or maybe no. Wait, this says Cloud9. Now it doesn't, of course. Fuck you, stupid ass game. Oh my god. <laughs> Literally zero attack. Well, if it doesn't have Cloud9, its other ability is freaking heat proof. It wasn't heat proof, it was probably thick fat. That had to be thick fat, actually. you're having a wonderful morning. I'm five hours and 20 minutes into my weird stream, but it, I'm two for four on Charon today. Not too bad. Um, died in the Verbank Complex the first time. This is my second run, in which a Florida Mon Flareon, Floridion got me this far. <laughs> it's Florida Man because it was uh, Drizzle Hurricane. Leaf Tornado. <laughs> and Muddy Water. <laughs> oh, such a good fucking Pokemon. Dude, this, it was just trash, though.
I love that mod though. I'm like, I'm like so, I'm so attached to it, honestly. Hurricane never misses in the rain, so it was a Giga Chad. Wow, I made those levels back up thanks to that Blissey. There's the Volcarona. Two shit moves, honestly. I don't think Volcarona was viable. We'll check it, though. Uh, that's it before Roxy. So here's your Roxy, Pred. Good luck, guys. Will I beat Roxy with this Charizard? Roxy has a Rock-type move that's physical. Well, I'm probably dead. But... The pride is open, you decide. Mind I have a full restore and a lemonade. I'll get a fresh water in the gym and I have another one. Don't have my fret my soda pop anymore, but that's way more heals than I usually have, so. Good luck. 30 seconds. Just put something in, either side. I honestly have no idea which one we'll be closer to. We need to be careful with blue flare, but I do have that ether. It's gonna be my go-to move. It's gonna be really tough to balance PP in here. There are 10 Pokemon. Magical leaf coverage to get through here, I think. It's just my best case. Or I need a shitty mon that I can just swift like this one. Probably just go for it. Perfect. Good start. <laughs> if I had that move, I would be trash. Nice. Okay. So let me one-shot this. Come on. Nice. Dude, good start. I don't care about the lack of XP. I need to get through here without using Blue Flare. That's like the most necessary thing. Give me, give me some water types. Water rock types would be huge right now. Caracosta. I don't feel comfortable with this. Do not want a blue flare though, it's a mid evo. Okay. Nice, it's throwing. Oh. Yuxi! Forced my hand to blue flare. Assuming it doesn't outspeed me, yeah. Four can do it. Does that give me a level? Probably not. Okay. Four can do it. Let's do it. I think I want to do that, but whatever, it's better than withdraw. Besides imposter. Nice. That's really good. 
Darmaka. No misses. Cool. <laughs> cool, man. Eh, what can I say? Nice job, believers. I'm not happy about that. This is a perilous run, though, no matter how you slice it. Need a PP max, it's the best item in the game right now. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be teachable, isn't it? It's gonna be teachable. Oh, <laughs> bro, that's fucked. No, that wasn't Flareon, that was an Oshawott. Oh, that's so fucking stupid, man. Every time. Every goddamn time, man. How does it happen to you? Just how does it happen? <laughs> it doesn't happen. <clears throat> Hope you're having a good morning, Dustin. A fucking course, dude. It's just killer. It's just... Oh, everybody can learn it. Yeah, the whole fucking party can learn it, man. Florida man could learn it. God damn, dude. That is so fucked. Florida man- Florida Mon was literally just a few battles away from learnable Tailgloom. Not like he had any special defense, but... Yeah, what are the odds? The odds are- the odds are exclamation point odds. They're 50%. Holy troll, man. Holy fucking troll. Bro, I can't. I need content for the next stream. We have to pause this one. I have to pause it. <laughs> Five and a half hour stream. Thank you guys for watching. Much appreciated. I hope you enjoyed the stream today. I hope I made your days better in some capacity. Join me for a raid. Join me for a rage. Did Jordan recently? Blah, 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 blah. Loose. Let's raid. Hopefully Loose isn't going offline. Uh, don't go to bed, Loose, maybe. Maybe Loose is going to bed. I can't tell. All she's doing is looking at a log. I'm scared. Maybe we'll do it anyways, though. Alright, let's raid loose. Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you, thank you. Please don't go offline. Don't do this to me. <laughs> don't do this to me. Alright, raid with Wowie boy. Or Wowie if you're not sub. Join the raid to get channel points. I could ask. I don't have to.
I gotta go to sleep. I gotta go to sleep. And if not, we're making your day better for five minutes, right? And I hope I made your guys' days better. Follow if you haven't. Look forward to the continuation of this run next stream, which may be tomorrow if I am feeling it. If not, join the Discord so you know when to keep up. Cool. Thanks for vibing. We finally made it back to Castilia. Poggers. Well, hopefully we do. We should. Okay. Peace out, guys. Look forward to the alt stream tomorrow, too, for Animal Crossing City Folk. Golden Net runs to return.